Yeah, so uh, my name is Vincent Hetzberger. Yes, oh, do not adjust your screen. I am black. <laughs> hey, what's going on, guys? My name is Sean. I am. I'm also go by SB Prodigy. Yeah. Uh, no, no, oh, no, talk. First of all, let's say let, let's give one thing clear. Not many people in the hood have good credit. So and how you are they getting these talk, You can Toro. talk shit. Oh, you talking anything. about? You can't say that. Yes, the fuck I can. Nobody in the fucking hood got good credit <laughs> because they put their fucking PSNG bill, cable bill, all that shit in the kid's name. Yeah, that's true. All right, so everybody. Know- Hey, what's up, everybody? It's another episode of What's the True Podcast, where, as you can see, we are down two guys, but we have a brand new uh, crew with us. They're only stepping in for these guys. They'll be back next week, but uh, we got two new guys with us. They'll be stepping in for these guys, um, and you'll get to learn these guys as I will get to pick their brains about what they do, and you'll get to learn these guys as well. So... Um, introduce yourself to the right of me. Uh, his name is Vinny, but I'll let him introduce himself uh, thoroughly. Go ahead. Yeah, so uh, my name is Vincent Hetzberger. Yes, oh, oh. do not adjust your screen. I am black. <laughs> um, first Italian name and the uh, last name is Jewish. Don't ask me about where it came from. Papa was a Rolling Stone, as most black people go through. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> there you go. And to the left of me. Hey, what's going on, guys? My name is Sean. I am. I'm also go by SB Prodigy. I I am a newfound music producer and p- potentially a rapper, but we will get into that. <laughs> nice. There you go. Hey, and I'm you fine. will get to you will get into that thoroughly later. Um, but right now, I'll let everybody know uh, how's everybody week been doing. Uh, I've been pretty good, pretty solid. Yeah. Everybody been good? Nah, the week was trash. I think um, <laughs> this pollen is killing me. There you go. I am sneezing yeah. and I cannot stop sneezing. Mm. Yep. I am popping Zyrtec like, uh, I don't know, what what are the pills that people take today? Zannies, I guess? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> I am... Uh, I'm like a fiend for Zan- uh, for uh, for Zyrtec, so yeah. um, I, I'm I'm sneezing and I my eyes I, I got I'm taking the Visine. It's, 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 this stuff is bad out here. Yeah. I'm, I'm glad it rained today. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you might be right. I'm with you. <laughs> yeah, that, that's my week too. Fighting that, fighting that. Uh, yeah, it's, the pollen. Yeah, it's bad. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Um, Luckily, I, I haven't had to deal with pollen and uh, allergies like that. But yeah. I um, refuse to cut my grass. I had got some dude to do that <laughs> shit, man. I, that, I, I've been I've been messed up too, man. So, with that. I remember one year I had to jump in a car because I could not breathe at the cut in my grass. Yeah. Gotcha. And I okay. jumped in a car just to cut the AC on. Not sure if it was going to help or not. So he could breathe. <laughs> not, not sure if it was going to help or not, but I just felt like I couldn't breathe. Yeah. I said, I got to get out of here. It's ridiculous. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I, I, I'm, well, I'm bad. It, it's real bad. Well, I'll tell you this much. COVID did help because wearing that face mask while you cutting. <laughs> that's true. Uh, yeah, right. It's yeah, amazing. Yeah, yeah, right, yeah. Because I you saying do it. I used to be, right. I'm a warrior. I don't need that damn face mask. Yeah, yeah out true. there hacking it. As soon as you get in the house, you're there. Oh, yep. oh. Yep. 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 <laughs> that's exactly what happened. <laughs> Yeah, Chuck the worst man. Y'all gotta watch Charles. He he cut everything. He do everything with no mad. Well, he used to. Used I should to. say. Nah, I yeah, stopped that shit. yeah. He, wood popping in your eyes. Wood and everything. Yeah, oh, yeah. he's a he, he was a beast, that, yeah. but he, now he's a smart a man. He done metal, smartened up. Now. Metal shavings in my eye. Uh, nah. Oh hell no. Yeah, no. that shit happened. I know. Yeah, I know somebody at work that got fucking a uh, piece of metal stuck in the eye. They had to go get. Oh my like, god, get damn, stuck, though. damn! I'm happy that didn't happen. Yeah, that I'm motherfucker got he got a piece of metal stuck in his fucking eye. I'm like, Damn. holy shit. Visible. Yeah. Was it visible? Wow. Damn. wow. No, 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 no. It wasn't visible. It was like a small he kept like, what is this in my eye? Couldn't what is this in my eye? Mm-hmm. So he went to the eye doctor and I'm like, you got a little strap metal fucking stuck in your eye. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, God damn. Yeah. So piece of bullet. Mm-hmm. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Jeez. Damn. 
It's crazy. Yeah, I'm done. But that that that's the week, and uh, I think we got some cool off weather, so the rain I think helped out. Yes, I think it's supposed to rain tomorrow too. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So. It says fifty percent chance. Yeah. So. I'll be out in it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I got a soccer game to go to. Oh, okay. Two soccer uh, games. Uh, um, they it's might, a to- it, tournament. It, it won't get rained out. Nah, they play if it's not if it's raining. If it's not, not? If it's not lightning, they're playing. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah, if it's not nice. lightning, they're playing. So I'll be, I'll be out there. Okay. All day. nice. Yeah. Not nice. No, nah, no, nah, I say but nice I because now they <laughs> they cancel stuff for everything. So oh, yeah. True. back then yeah. we played in everything. At least yeah. they got, at least they got like what the artificial turf or grass. Yeah. They not playing in mud. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. That's true. These kids is weak today. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That wasn't me. Seven place <laughs> trophy. <laughs> Take ownership, man. What place did you come in? Uh, <laughs> Take ownership, man. I came, I I came in 12th place. Good job. I got a trophy. Yeah. <laughs> we, we ain't going to get into that. <laughs> no. Step over. No. Then we'll start that way? No. No? Okay. okay. Uh, people are too... Uh, uh, too soft in their feelings mm-hmm. 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 Shit like that so. People is gangster That's watching us mm-hmm. 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 No uh, You might be right Yeah <laughs> <laughs> Probably yeah Audience But team. for the most part Yeah people uh, I'm trying to get A big audience yeah, uh, and, and, and the big audience Is uh, Yeah PC. I like you guys. What are you talking about? <laughs> I, like, I, like, I like you guys. Hey, hey, love y'all. We I love, love you everybody. Guys. I love the big audience. What are you talking about? Keep watching. Keep watching. This is a great show. Right. Yeah. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Right. Yeah. And, and another friend. Tell another friend. Oh, yeah. Right. About this. Go ahead and uh, hit that uh, subscribe button. Yeah, yes. boy. Yeah. Let me tell you something. I am a fan and I'm grateful to be up here to, with these guys. Like, I be having, I be waiting for it to come on. So there you I, go. You know, I'm happy to be here. So. And and the other half of our show is going to let you know what this guy does uh, on his on his spare time, so you can subscribe to his channel. There All right. Go. Yes. Yes. And yes. We'll, we'll get into do. that in just a bit. I second that. I think the uh, show is also amazing. Oh, there you go. I think um, it's good to see the grassroots of this show. Yeah. There you go. I like being here and seeing the uh, the growth. There you go. And uh, hopefully, you guys don't forget me in the well, basement once you blow up. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. Well, 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 by the way, change their phone number on us. Sh- yeah, yeah. By the way, that's who, the- who is this? I don't know who the fuck he is. It's a Vinny. It, 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 who the fuck you, is Vinny? I don't know Vinny. If you saw the first episode, the voice in the background. He got a face. True. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. That, yeah. The voice in the background yeah, yeah. heard me talk to you saying, hey, Vinny, you, 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 <laughs> know, you, yeah. you, you know what this is? That's him right That's here. He got That's a face it. on yeah. him. Cheers. There you go. Cheers. Face to the name. <laughs> um, but uh, what I want to do is uh, real quick, I don't want to spend too much time on it because we spent a, a lot of time on the previous uh, topic and it and, and just so happened, damn, uh, a, a couple of weeks later, we had another incident with uh, with another mass shooting. Uh, but I don't want to spend too much time on it. But I will. What I will say and need to say is um, prayers to the family who lost loved ones um, to this tragic event um, in Texas. I'm pretty sure everybody knows. I don't need to, you know. Go over what happened um, But Prayers to everyone who lost Somebody in this tragic event It's, it's Mindless what ha- would have happened um, it, it, it didn't need to happen I don't know why it happened but prayers to everyone Who lost somebody in that in, in that tra- Tragic event Yeah, yeah man that yeah. Was well, crazy. I, I just got to update just one thing that uh, Kind of made me Sad this morning the, one of the teachers that was on the that got killed in the school, the husband passed away mm-hmm. from a heart attack. Mm. Yeah, because he couldn't. You no, know, whatever. I don't know whatever he's going through. But the case may be he got four kids. Mm. So just imagine mm. what's going on in those kids' minds right now. Yeah, it's sad. Yeah, it's sad. Yeah, I can imagine what was going on in his mind. And then you know, then, oh, man, that's crazy. I don't know. I right. think you definitely should uh, seek some counseling or something if you're going through that. Get around friends, do something because, uh, right, that could happen. Yeah, right. So, um, rest in peace, all the people who 
passed away from this brutal attack and um everybody who's lost someone keep their heads up in prayers keep the keep those people in prayers who who lost someone yeah it's just it's, it's crazy terrible senseless senseless stupid stupid um uh, but i i i want to say i hope it doesn't happen again but that that's that's not a that i'm pretty sure that won't be the case but um again um prayers to everyone who lost someone and prayers out to those who were lost yeah. yep no all right so hard to transition hard to transition from that but we will um we have two new guys on this uh, panel here. Hey, everybody. Yep. I'm new. <laughs> Mr. Dooney had to learn how to work some more tricks for the Dooney. <laughs> <laughs> he said he apologized that he couldn't make it today. One person is, uh, one person has, uh, he's, he's in, a, he's in a, a very big, very, a very large uh, car club. There you go. And uh, he, he's the VP of that car club. And he had to travel down to uh, Myrtle Beach to, you know, support that. Uh, so shout out to him. Shout out to Fortune. Fortune, aka Four Five. Fortune. We, we we with you, bro. When we get when you get back next week. Um, the other person, uh, Mr. Dooney. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> hashtag Dooney. Hashtag hashtag Mr. Dooney. Mm-hmm. Geo. Uh, he had a little, you know, he had a little issue. He had to take care of that, so he he couldn't make it today. Mm-hmm. But he will be back next week, folks. So for all you guys who you know who who tune in and see that man, I, I know a lot of ladies loving him. Yeah, uh, yeah, maybe absolutely. Maybe a couple, maybe. Maybe a couple dudes out. But yeah, so yeah, he'll, both of those guys will be back next week. But I did get some fill-ins. Yes, um, so and I ones. will. What I will do is let you guys uh, get to know these guys. Um, yeah. Uh, one of which you, you, you've you heard in the background. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, it, it, so you can see his, his face to the name that I've been yelling out in the, in the very first episode. The other is an up-and-coming producer, uh, music, music producer. Mm-hmm. Um, and I'll let you uh, uh, get to know him as well. Um, but first, I'm going to start with... Uh, Mr. Vinny. Yes. Vincent. I'm here. There you go. <laughs> Absolute. In the flesh, baby. <laughs> um, so I know a lot of people uh, are, are, are looking for jobs. Uh, guys want to be entrepreneurs. Uh, I shouldn't say looking for jobs. I say a lot of people were, uh, in this pandemic, a lot of people strayed away from looking for jobs mm. and they want to be entrepreneurs. They want to you know, create their own business. But a lot of people don't really want to go that route. A lot of people, uh, I mean, entrepreneur is cool, but I like to work. I want to work. So <clears throat> I'm going to give you an avenue that you can look into, that you can become, um, that you, you know, if you don't want to be an entrepreneur, you can look into this particular business if you want to become, you know, you know, you know, I know a lot of people want to become nurses, yeah. you know, shit like that. Mm-hmm. But no, here's another avenue you can take. Here's my first interview mm. that I will uh, uh, conduct. So you don't have to look into being, you know, uh, things like a nurse or, you know, like I said, or things like, you know, typical things that people, you know, uh, everybody does. Here's another. Av- I'm going to give you another avenue to take. To make uh, top dollars, so you can survive, in, so you can survive in this economy, and, yeah. and and trust me, trust me, this brother <laughs> gets paid very well for for what he does, <laughs> very well. Yeah. Um, yeah, no, I, you know, I've been doing what I've been doing for a while. Um, I'm not here to try to sound ambiguous, but uh, that's a big word. Hey, hey, there you go. Well, <laughs> shit. He get paid very it's, well. It's, to, it's, it's he, get, he gets paid very well to speak very well. <laughs> so I don't expect him to be what? saying some. I don't know what that means. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. I know. I think he said he, hey. he am big. He's right. Big. He's big. That's what just he just look it up as he's talking. <laughs> That's all you got to do. Put the captions on. <laughs> yeah. But um, no. So 
I got started in IT a very, very long time ago, over 20 years ago. Um, but before I even get into the history of how I got started and why I chose it, uh, I think my message to everyone, if you are trying to start something new, whether that's trying to be an entrepreneur, like Tim just said, or whether you're trying to get into an industry uh, that you are interested in. I think the number one thing that any and everyone needs to do is educate yourself, right? Don't go trying to jump into things that you know nothing about. Mm -hmm. So my message uh, to everyone is just educate yourself, right? Uh, maybe you won't, don't like IT. You know, maybe you don't like uh, being a mechanic or being a machinist or being a scientist or a doctor or a lawyer, right? So just educate yourself on that. And, you know, the way I found out how I wanted to do something that, that, that I guess, challenged me was I liked math when I was in school. I liked the feeling or the good feeling that I felt when I solved the problem, right? That gave me, it just gave me some, some satisfaction, Damn. right? So... I knew I wanted to do something with solving problems. Regardless of what it may have been, I wanted to solve problems. I didn't want to just go to work every day and push a button. Yeah. You know, so, so that, you know, I, I don't, you know, we can go into the whole, you know, IT bit, which is what I'm doing today. Um, but Tim says, you know, I'm getting paid a lot of money. I am getting paid very money. well. However, yeah. I've been doing this for 20 years. No one's just jumping into yeah. anything today. Making what you make. And making a lot of money, right? So, you know, a lot of people also expect things, right? I've, I've seen the other side of the business because my wife is in HR. And I see a lot or hear a lot. And a lot of people are expecting to get paid well, right? And it's like, you know, what is your experience? What is your background? You know, why do you deserve this? But, um, but yeah, that, that uh, you know, without diving too much in there, without, you know, holding a floor or format, mm -hmm. number one, I'll say in anything you ever do, whatever you decide to do, whether you're just going to college, whether you're getting into high school, whether you're transitioning to a new job, whether you're transitioning to a new relationship, educate yourself, right? And that, that I, I cannot say that enough in All right, anything. So, so let me ask you, what made you look into the industry of IT? So, when I was, let's say, 18, um, I went to college for computer science. Again, leaving, uh, I, I probably did the highest math. Shout out to all my bulldogs out there in Ro -ro Malcolm X Shabazz High School. Yo, okay. Right, yo, okay. Right okay, okay, okay. <laughs> um, but I did the highest math actually at that school. Um, I went up to trigonometry um, in math in high school. Trig. I went up to trig. Damn. Yeah, Malcolm X, they have that. I didn't even know they had oh, that. Oh, they have it. They have I it. They make it past geometry. Nah, they, they, they got trigonometry up there. I knew they had it. I just couldn't get to that level. <laughs> um, I, I so so that, level. that that <laughs> initial part, now they did want me to do pre-cal, which is pre-calculus. They did mm -hmm. want me to do that. Um, I, I truly didn't. Uh, care to do it because uh, I would have had to do it. I would have had to do calculus and I would have had to do um, um, trig as well. And I didn't want to do both maths in my senior year. Mm -hmm. But my senior year, I did do trig. I had trigonometry. Mm -hmm. um, and I so went again, home. <laughs> <laughs> they say you now, got half a day. I say peace. <laughs> well, well, so and, and you know what? I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy. He mentions that. Yep. I also left school oh, you at did one leave. o'clock. Oh, snap. Okay. I also left school at one o'clock. And then went to go work a full-time job at Sears oh. from 2 p.m. to 10 p.m. Mm. So, again, getting into IT, I knew I wanted to do something that solved problems, that gave me that satisfaction. Mm -hmm. um, I, I will say, when I was 18, I went off to college. Uh, I had a child at 19. Um, when I had that child at 19, obviously, I had to drop out of college. Yep. Um, after I dropped out of college, being a computer science major, I started getting my certifications. So any IT certification, that's what I started doing. Um, from there, I was doing a security guard job. And at the same time of doing that security guard job, 
I was working in the IT department for free. Okay. There you go. Say that word again. For free. <clears throat> a lot of people don't want to do that All right. anymore. In other words, that means he was an intern. There you go. I was an intern. There you go. And I was dedicating my time away from my newborn child. Okay. So now we talk about educating yourself, but now I have to use another word, which is ambition. Mm. Okay. No one's going to do it for you. And or sacrifice. 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 Yes. Yep. No one's going to do it for you. Um, you know, so after working as a security guard and then working in the uh, working in the IT department or MIS department, it was called, I was going in the morning from the beginning. I was going in the morning and then after going uh, in the morning, I was signing in doing my security job. HR said, this is a risk. You're off the clock in the morning. Mm -hmm. You cannot do that. Oh, wow. What are you doing? Why are you here? So my manager and the MIS manager got together, and I then transitioned into IT mm. in the year 2000. So thanks to those guys, uh, because if HR never would have intervened, I probably would still be walking a beat in a manufacturing uh, uh, factory. Uh, yeah. And I was a supervisor, though. I was a supervisor. Um, but again, it was, um, you know, I was 19, 20 years old. So uh, it was definitely, uh, you know, something that, you know, mm -hmm. it, it was meant to be. So, so what made you? How did you feel when you, when you were just, you know, technically a, a, a supervisor, you know, doing day to day jobs, and then you transition to what you now, twenty years in, are an IT person. Yeah, no, nah, I think it was a, I think it was a great feeling. I think um, I was able to fit in real well with those guys because I was going in the morning so i knew everyone i knew the company i was walking around so i knew everyone whether that was hr whether that was uh, uh workers in the factory i knew everyone so it was a very easy transition for me okay yeah cool um yeah sorry hey hey hey, hey. Have a little comedy out of this. Black people can't do other things. You gotta do the same three jobs. It's okay, man. It's okay. It's it's all right to step out of the boundaries of being a you know security guard. Mm -hmm. uh, it's all right to step out of the boundaries of working at Family Dollar yeah. or shit like that. Yeah. Uh, step out of the boundaries of being a nurse. I see everybody wants to be a nurse. Yeah. So, you know, Make shit like that. There's other alternatives. There's other jobs out there that you can do. Yeah. Which is. And uh, and it. You yeah. might be the only person I know who does that. Correct. That's, that's rare. I don't know. Correct. That's a human. Very that does unique that. job. That's a unique but job. It's Correct. Uh, it, it pays. But, uh, again, I, uh, job. That, let's that say pays I very well. I didn't just jump to this. Yeah, okay, yeah. I didn't just jump to right. This. Like I said, he he's been like he said he said and I said he's been doing this for almost or mm -hmm. over twenty years. Yeah. 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 And and when we say twenty years, look, we all look great. We all know black don't crack. Mm -hmm. So when we say we've been working over twenty years. Uh, we just look good. We keep ourselves together. Uh, so, you know, we some good looking gentlemen up here on this uh, on this panel. <laughs> <laughs> you said 20 years, you're giving our age away as if I was just yeah, born, yeah. you know, could have been born yeah, five. I mean, you could have been doing this at 18. Yeah, exactly. but I, hopefully this uh, this video causes, you know, some exposure to IT. Correct. And, yeah. You know, peak you know. in other people's interests. You know, so. that is the whole purpose yes. to give you another avenue at a job if you are not that entrepreneur. Because everybody's not an entrepreneur. Yeah. Everybody can't run their own business. Nope. And nope. I don't. I'm not knocking for anybody who can't run their own business. Everybody can't do that. Well, I'm gonna tell. I'm gonna keep it real. I'm not running my own business. There you go. Everybody's everybody so can't do that. Everybody so say, rough. "Oh, run your own business." You know, you make. No. Everybody can't do that shit. No, no. no. everybody I'm Indian. Everybody, everybody can make a lot of money uh -huh. just working a regular I ain't job. Chief, I'm the, I'm the you guy. Said, oh, I, okay. I, I you do like yeah, the yeah, groundwork. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, right. I, I ain't right. the chief. Yeah, I ain't man. the. I don't want to be at the top. I'm no, good. Absolutely, right. ain't I'm nothing good. wrong with that, man. Ain't I'm nothing good. wrong with that. Now, I, I'll do I, some I, side I, hustles. That's different, but full blown. Right. Yeah. Like telling people what to do, pay, cutting paychecks. I'm not. Right. That's yeah. not my level. Everybody's not built I'm for fine. that. I'm not built. And you're and you're and you're looking at one right now. Everybody's not built for that. I'm not built for that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And, and when you start getting people under you, uh, as I do, you know, sometimes you have to have difficult conversations. Right? Yeah. So, right. you know, what what are these uh, guys doing or not doing with their time that's not contributing to the best of the business's, um, you know, outcome, right? Yep. So it's one of these things where it's definitely difficult, but, you know, my, my thought process on that is, you know, 
everyone, no, regardless of field, yeah. should want the company to succeed. Hell yeah. You want your company to win. Because right. if they don't win, you will be out of a I'm job. I'm about to say that. You go. <laughs> right? So if you don't want to work for me and you don't want to take my direction, please do it for the company mm -hmm. and the organization because without them getting these millions or billions of dollars or trillions when we start talking about Amazon, Microsoft, <laughs> mm -hmm. Google, ABC, look these companies up. But when you start working for these organizations, you tend to be a, you know, is looked bad upon, but company man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I want the business to succeed. Yeah. The more they succeed, the more the the, the more generous they're going to be to 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 me. Yeah. Right. right? I, I want a I want a big bonus. Yeah. I yeah. want a big I want a big increase. Right? So if you're not going to do it for me and you want to be, you know, lazy, go do that somewhere else. I you agree. Know, do your job. Everybody want to try to get over. Yeah. Do your damn job. I agree. Don't, don't stop stop trying to find shortcuts. Yeah, yeah. Right. So let me ask you um where what where were you at your point of life where you decided to I'm going to take the IT route? Um I think my wife was pregnant. As, as a matter of fact, and I don't even know if I told anyone this ever. Um uh -oh. and I think my wife is the only Exclusive. person that <laughs> <laughs> Exclusive, exactly. Yeah, I know my what my wife knows about my wife knows about it. But okay. I'll be honest with you, when I was to Tim's point asking me that question when I was 19 years old and I found out I was having a child, I actually thought about joining the Marines. Mm. Oh. I actually thought about joining the Marines. From our neighborhood, I, that's not that's too that's, far that's off. Uh, <laughs> typical. Yeah. yeah, I from, I agree. From where we from that's that's I, I feel I like agree. that's our way out for some reason. It it it, it, it really is. Yeah, yeah. Well, it I'm really glad is. You did. And, and 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 you know what? I'm not that I'm happy that I didn't, but this time period of nothing against the the military. Nothing against the military did. at all. Yeah. But but the you know God has a plan, right? Yeah. And again, I don't know. You know, followers. Oh God. Oh, here we go talking about yeah. God. No, what I'm saying is well, God has a plan, right? So we all know, 2001. Mm -hmm. That's why. That's 11? what I was thinking about, bro. That's why okay. I said that. Did we all? Did we all just graduate? Mm -hmm. Well, I don't know about you, but did we all just yeah, graduate we, high school? Yep. Yeah. I was. I'm. I'm class of '98. Shout out. Shout out oh. to the Bulldogs '98. <laughs> but 2001, <laughs> them towers. Yes. Yeah. Went Scariest down. moment. Mm -hmm. So if I would have been in the military, mm -hmm. all right. no, there's no saying if I even would have been here to have this conversation. Mm -hmm. Right. So. So. How I thought about IT is because I initially enrolled as a computer science major. Once I had to drop out of college, I started doing those certifications to at least continue to pursue some type of IT. Getting out of high school, it was IT. Now, I will say this, and, and, and I'm, I'm going to talk to everybody here, mm -hmm. okay? Even people on the panel. Mm -hmm. Everyone needs to understand home row keys, do we understand home row keys? Yes. I'm Sean lost. understands home row keys. I, I'm, I'm, I'm the retarded one. So. <laughs> no, don't, don't. This is not proper English. I'm no, the retarded no, no, no. I'm just the retarded one. one. You got to explain it. <laughs> <laughs> Slow motion. <laughs> no, 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 no. Explain it. Explain Sean. It. No, no, no. Let's Sean. What are home row keys? Hmm. You talking about on the. Yes. So just the basic, the basic keys, like just no, having the knowledge of. Where everything is located, but home row keys. Home row. Oh shit! I might not be. <laughs> I might. I might actually. Be. So this is a trick question. Now <laughs> yeah. the reason why I mention this is because in my profession, I'm on the keyboard a lot. Yeah. But I've been taking typing classes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Since being a freshman in high school. Okay. okay. I so, learned that from Miss Johnson. I think I might know where you're going. <laughs> oh, Shout right. out to Miss Johnson. God she bless was mean to me. <laughs> A S D F. Oh, oh, yeah, oh hey, 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 we all know you smart. Can I finish? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> How about just saying that? You just brought up, it said, be in my brain. Oh, uh, so, so proper terminology. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And the last 
Um, G H J K L semicolon. This is incorrect. Next. Oh, oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> I'm embarrassed. I'm it must be the alcohol. <laughs> hold up, hold up. All right, hold up. Blame, blame, I'll say it blame so the you booze. Can blame hold the up. booze. I'll say a, it so you can hold finish. up. You said the the first A S D F G H J K. Oh shit! It ain't oh. A S. Fuck <laughs> it. You know what? I had too many of these. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's what it is. And, I, and I'm not doing this to put Sean on the spot. Oh no! I, trust me, I am not uncomfortable. I, I usually know it. A S A S D F J K L J K L semicolon. So he was close. He was on the right path. But the reason why I'm mentioning that is because again, learning how to type. Learning how to deal with corporate America and, and, and getting some qualifications to get you in the door, mm. right? I, I can teach you whatever you want to know about IT, but once I sit you at this computer, can you manage this computer? Mm -hmm. Can you start moving? Can you start multitasking, mm. right? So, again, it's, it's educate yourself, right? And I learned that at... As a, as, a, as a freshman in high school, and I, I feel like I learned it in seventh grade because I remember dealing with floppy drives, okay, and dealing with a... Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> this is going back, hey, but, hey, hey. But, but dealing with, <laughs> These, dealing with computers like, what the hell is at a that? very early age. Yeah, yeah. So, again, I, I got into it at an early, uh, early age, but again, it's, it's one of these things where I, I, just, I, I just cannot drive it home enough, but everyone, I think, needs to educate themselves, right? Definitely, okay. and it don't always have to be school. Just it doesn't have to be school. And again, I school. told you guys people, I dropped out. Yeah, you know, others like everybody might think just got to be school. Yeah, some people might not be school people. If you want to use YouTube, you want to read books. Yep, anything. Just better yourself at whatever you want to do. I agree. You I know, because everybody ain't built for school. I was a little retarded, so I took a trade. <laughs> no, this, this, this <laughs> word, this <laughs> word he uses, you gotta have to bleep oh, himself. Oh, oh damn, you got to bleep himself. And I he was one of the baddest <laughs> ones doing it. So, <laughs> so but but again, it's one cool. of these things where we 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 definitely should educate ourselves in any form or fashion. No, no, you're right. Uh, you're right. But but again, I dropped out. Mm -hmm. Got back into school. Um, so again, I got uh, my bachelor's degree and i got my master's degree there you go so again but but that's not that's not that was not necessary i was in it i made it i i, I transitioned without any of that right i transitioned i went from security guard to uh help desk immediately so i didn't have a master's or bachelor's at 19 20 years old mm -hmm. right but as i grew in the field i still had a yearning desire to educate myself, right? And then there's also some, there's an undertone out there, which again, I probably uh, agree with this undertone, but it feels like, and maybe we don't have to, but I feel like, this is my opinion, that I think we have to work harder. I think we have to have all the credentials. Mm -hmm. I think we have to be on a best behavior, right? I think we do not get the hookups, right? So when I jokingly at the beginning of this, a uh, uh, podcast or interview, whatever you want to call it, said, podcast, my, pod, pod. said my full name, right? This is what that I feel, my opinion, gets me in the door. Yes. When that face walked through the door, it's like, <laughs> no way. We no, no, Vincent. We let him in. <laughs> oh, and then you, you start talking, they go, okay, this guy, this is, he's good. He's good. <laughs> he's good. He ain't going in with the yo. But besides the fact that when they when he write his name on an application, they say, "Oh, we get yeah, we, we yo, yo yeah 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 we go we go we go get him in here, get him an interview. We gonna get him hired until mm -hmm. they see his face." And he's like, "Oh shit, I didn't." <laughs> yeah, yeah. The, face, the face don't match the name. Mm -hmm. <laughs> exactly. Well, look, uh, we ain't too far. I ain't too far. I don't think Charles Burnett is. Um, That'll get you in the door. That will get me in the door. That will get you in the door. Yeah. Charles <laughs> Burnett. Like, Google that. See who mm. pop up. It ain't going to be me. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't going to be my skin color either. <laughs> I, think, I think our parents did us well. Yes, <laughs> yes, yes. Very well. <laughs> yeah. if they, if they ain't do nothing else. They gave us some goddamn human name. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I got one more question for you. Yes, sir. So tell me the moment... Tell me a time when you knew, damn, this job is going to set me off very well mm. for the future. That's a good one. Um, 
Because I can tell you it probably was. Hmm. I want to say maybe two jobs ago. Uh, two jobs going back. And and but before you go full fledged, when you got that job, did you think it was a job, or once you got full fledged in it, was it a career? Well, I I think I knew I was in a career at a very early age, and it wasn't even because of money. It was because of uh, the thought process that I can go anywhere in a country or in a world and do the same job. Okay. Once I found that out, I was like, okay, this is pretty cool. I can go to London. I can go to China. I can do IT pretty much everywhere. And, and, and when I say IT, I mean specifically what I do today. I can take this and go anywhere. Yeah. Right. Um, in any company. Right. Small, big, whatever. Uh, but I want to say two jobs ago... And, and I got complacent two jobs ago. I was there for seven years. Um, but it was very family-oriented, tight-knit group of guys. Um, but I think it got uh, propelled when I got a phone call from a friend that I used to work with three jobs ago. I said, hey, are you looking for a job? I need you to come over here and run you know, this, that, and a third. And I said, hmm, okay, how much? I was like... Yeah, well, we can get you... uh, Well, actually, he didn't tell me how much, actually. I I asked him how much, uh, and he never got back to me because it was over text, um, which is... uh, I'm I'm still pissed off to this day. Uh, But but nonetheless, the reason why is because... And I'll tell you the story. The reason why is because he told me to go home that night, fill out the application. And on the application, I had to say what I wanted. Right? I had to say what did I want to get paid. Right? So on my application, I said seventy five thousand, right? So, um, yeah. So so two. So I got a phone call from a friend, and when I applied for the job, it said it was you know, it, it I had to put it on the application to submit the, for the job. So I said seventy five. Um, the friend finally calls me back. Let's say ten, eleven o'clock at night. I've done submitted it. I've said seventy five, and uh, he says. Damn man, I could have got you ninety five. Oh shit! Oh shit! What the hell? What the hell? So HR calls me. HR is like, yeah, we got your application. You know, your friend reference. Da 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 da. I said, yeah. Uh, can we do something about the salary? Said, uh, I know I put seventy five, but I want ninety five. <laughs> HR comes back. He says, okay, hold on. Let me go check. And uh, they came back and said, go fuck yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I took the job for 75 because it was still 10000 more than my previous job. It again. Um, but again, at that point, it just started to uh, propel at that point. This kid is going crazy on you. He is going crazy. <laughs> I mean, I, I'm pretty Two sure. years old. Yeah, yeah, right. He know how to work a damn phone. <laughs> So. Kids smart. Right. These kids smarter than we ever were. Yes, so what, what we'll do is uh, we'll, we'll we'll get that uh, screen back up and we'll take a quick quick break. But um, what we'll do is uh, to the left of me, my man is a, a producer, and what we'll do is we'll we'll, we'll play one of his uh, produced beats he got while we'll take a, a very very quick break while we while we get this back set up um, on the screen back here. Um, I don't know if when, uh, my man Charles want to set that up. There you go. All right, go ahead. Set that up for you so we can play that real quick while we uh, take a quick break so we can get that fixed so that problem doesn't happen again. Mom, with you or the wife? Here we go. Anyone, it doesn't matter. Let, 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 let's Everybody can hear my man producing these beats so you guys can listen to, join his uh, channel, SB Prodigy, on YouTube. There you go. I was making it work by myself I didn't want to care about nobody else But you came along and captured my heart This little About you, a song 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 about you, a song
show my repellent is at the doorway. I put in a guard on my heart, protection from all of the snakes in the dark. I don't wanna be all bitter, but this rough thing gotta get better. I didn't wanna care for nobody else. I just gotta write a song about you, a song about you. My bad. Uh, Shorty Dogs, uh, I'm sorry. SB Prodigy. What's up? What's up? What's up? <laughs> <laughs> Tell us uh, what, what, what's the name of that song right there. So that one um, is called Threw Me Off. Yeah, Threw Me Off. Um, okay, there you go. Yeah, it's, um, it's actually an artist who i grown to admire because she decided to um, take some time off of this. And she... Um, she was inspired to get back into singing when she started hearing my beats. Um, just so happened, she's my wife. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Nice. And, um, it's, it's cool, like, um, the fact that we, we are able to find something that we both enjoy doing together. Mm. And it's, I, I want to say it, it, has, it has, brought, has brought us close together. It's brought us, like, like really close together. And um, we've been having fun with it. We've been having fun with it. Um, she she like inspires me to to do this and i'm inspired to keep doing it because i want to p- be better every time so good yeah okay all right yeah but nice. uh, but yeah man um pretty much I, I i just got into this like a few months ago um i i end up putting a studio in my basement because i have a friend also a business partner who is who's act, who's an actual musician and I wanted to get in on the management you know um side of it but um I mean it's in my basement so I figured hell maybe I should uh you know try to teach myself a few things and prior to that I had no experience on none of this shit and I was like yo uh this is kind of I don't want to say easy no oh. but um yeah, this is kind of you know it's not as difficult as I thought out thought it was. I ain't gonna lie. Nah, nah, psh, listen, it's levels to this shit. Um, <laughs> I was humbled today when I went. I went to. I had um, two studio sessions today. Um, shout out to Picasso, and shout out to uh, Danny out in East Orange, Picasso and Bayonne. Man, these guys are like geniuses. They gurus for real, man. Um, Oh, bef- before you get super detailed, in yeah. it, let me uh, thank uh, Vinny for uh, letting everybody know a different avenue they can take as far as you know getting into the in, into the workforce, which is uh, IT. Yeah, uh, the IT workforce. Um, so thank you very much for that. Letting yeah, everybody explain and what that is and how you can uh, get into it. And, you absolutely. Know. Uh, I, I still don't understand it. Yeah. Okay. Well, 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 yeah. And, and, and but, we're but, using and we're using an acronym IT. Let's just you know you information technology. There you oh, go. Oh, Thank wow. you. See, I Thank you. Something else new again. There was, you go. <laughs> that, that's that's, that's why you are here to explain case. what it is. Just in but case. it was an international telephone. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for clearing that up, buddy. That's why there I am not an IT. But um, I will. I, I tell you one thing, um, Vince. You could definitely get into the music thing. Oh, because we all grew up listening to music, so I know you have a good ear for it. You was you was once called a rebel. Ooh. We oh, I'm, I'm digging deep, ain't Ooh. it? Ooh. I don't want yeah. we don't want to hurt nobody's feelings. Easy, yeah, let me Easy. tell you, we don't want to hurt nobody's feelings. Easy. This guy, y'all, we talking about Vincent? Oh no, he wasn't <laughs> hey. always Vincent. Hey, oh. the way we grew up, <laughs> oh man, you never thought he'd go that route. <laughs> 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 oh, this thing is, that's what made it even worse. <laughs> oh. Listen, I'm proud it's of crazy. Who he yeah, hey man, oh, hey, man. Sweet, thank sweet. you. 
sweep, man. Appreciate sweep, that. Sweep, sweep that history mm-hmm. under the rug. Uh, man. Uh, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> you got to start somewhere. You got to start somewhere. Can't be somewhere. embarrassed of your past. Nah, it was... It was that made yeah. us, though. Believe I, I, I tell you, hmm. uh, I think I think Hawk got all of the raps. If you want some... Uh, no, no. Well, yeah, you can't even rap like that. No, no you're about to say we get canceled. I'll tell you... um. My, you know, I was called MC Sock. Socko. Socko. <laughs> Wait, Socko. MC, MC Sock. <laughs> um, and look, uh, yeah, those those raps was uh, those, those raps brutal was, classics. Those man. raps was brutal. It's brutal. Yeah. Those raps so now on the air is brutal. Back then, nah, you, you, yeah, back then, nineteen ninety four, ninety three, it was it was okay. But now you hurt no. people' feelings. <laughs> I'm talking about. Ejaculation on the sheets. Oh my god! I'm talking about you know, <laughs> mm-hmm. effing this one, effing that one. You know, mm-hmm. threesomes, trains. We threw that word out a lot easy uh, back in the day, right? Mm-hmm. Train yes. this, train, train that. Yes. I don't even know if anybody running trains no more. These sorry ass <laughs> kids. <laughs> <laughs> they might just don't call it that. Go nah, on. Uh, I'm sorry, you know they do have no, no, no. They, they no, they. no. These kids crazy as hell. They do, but I don't know if they call it that. That's <laughs> oh, that's the that's okay. the question. Well, they did say that the these kids not having sex like we was back in the day. Mm. Oh. They cool with having sex with text messages. Oh. Huh? They call it sexting. Oh. Sex? Tell them, oh. Telling me, telling you what I would do to you. Oh, no. We oh. was, we was what is fuck- this? Demolition man? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, I'll tell you this much. My, mind I, fucking you. <laughs> I, I, did, I did find out first base is, is getting a blowjob. Oh. Damn. Oh, yeah, oh first base done moved uh, up a couple they, notches. Only, after. Only blowjob hit. was a home run. We was that growing mean, up. That means I only hit doubles and sing, uh, triples. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Never hit a fucking Psycho. home run, bro. Yo, yeah, that Could you imagine if they got a home run? Yeah. Woo. I couldn't imagine what that is. They probably doing some shit that we didn't do. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They still say they virgins. <laughs> oh, what? Because you never penetrated, they, you know. Oh, damn. Uh, well, so yeah, they put it in their mouth, they still a virgin. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. I mean, right. if I was in this era, I'll take it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, I, I agree. Yeah. I, I totally agree. Thank you. Hell yeah. I'm Don't. just gonna sit here and you just do your damn job. Yeah. Sound like a good deal to me. <laughs> yeah. Yo, shout out to Sako. Yeah, man, those raps was uh, legendary, man. Shout out to Gonzo. I Yo, know he gonna Gonzo, Gonzo. He was rapping. Oh, shit. Yeah. Rest yeah. in peace, Rest Big in Rob. Peace, Big Rob. Right, we, we, you already know, man. We, we'll play Sako. It's gonna get a beep like every other word. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> so yeah. you might not uh, oh, yeah. enjoy it. <laughs> yeah, y'all don't want to hear that today. No, no, no. no. All yeah, right, that was that was bad. But get back, get back to Mister uh, yeah, yeah. uh, SB. 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 What's up, SB? Yeah, man. man. So, yeah. so um, um, go ahead, go ahead. My bad, bro. No, no problem. Mm-hmm. Um, so let us know. Let let everybody know what, why, why, why did you get into this industry? So. Um, and by industry, I mean music producer, uh, music producer industry. Yeah, right. You changed the man cave to a studio. Yeah, that yeah. Take a lot of balls because I man. Really did it. Let me tell you, <laughs> man. Did man then did just put up a fucking sticker in his room and said this is a music. He fucking went yeah. all out. Yeah, he went yeah. full blown. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. You talk about insulated walls, everything. Yeah. Wow. Full blown, amazing studio. Right. Somebody, somebody want to you know uh, lay down a, a, a hot sixteen? This man basement is the place to do it. Yeah, exactly. man. I'm, I'm looking. <laughs> I'm actually looking for an artist, man. Come holla at me. Um, it's crazy because well, yeah, I was let us, struggling. Let us know how you started. I was struggling to find a rapper, and um, well, I'll, I'll get into that. But I, I just pretty much started because um, I got into it with with an artist, with an artist, and uh, uh, my my partner who, who's also a music music producer, and I just felt like I wasn't bringing nothing to the table really. So. Um, I wanted to bring more to the table. And, um, you know, the reality is people got their own lives. Everybody's busy. Mm-hmm. Blah, blah, blah. So um, I was like, man, let me see what this is about. I, I opened up, you know, I turned on the computer, started messing around with it. I was, I, you know, I, I figured it out, man. And I just been going, man. Before you know it, uh, like I said, wifey pulled up. She started hearing some of the beats. She she thought it was pretty cool, you know. You know your 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 wife, but uh, she gonna be your biggest cheerleader. Yeah. yeah. But when you start bringing it to other people, I, you I know, would hope so. and they like, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I, I mean, could you imagine she'd have pat me on the back and be like, uh, "Baby, I love you, but this shit is trash." <laughs> that would have been over. It would have been done right there. Like, get back up. I don't even want to do this no more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that's um, true. 
But yeah, she ain't, she you know she been around, so she's she's her other you know mu- you know other um, producers and their music and stuff like that. And for her to compliment me with no experience and say that it's good and and I know she was being genuine. She wasn't you know just trying to gaslight. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. So I if I would have felt I would have saw right through that. But that's a young man's that's word. A young man's yeah. word. <laughs> I think I just, I just I just heard that from my daughter. There you right. go. I'm using, yeah. it. I'm using it. There you go. I like that gas. Spe- hey, hey gas man, light. speaking out of terms, man. We don't want to hear that shit. <laughs> nah, come on, man. We gotta stay young, man. Souping you up. <laughs> I thought it was a. Re- <laughs> I thought go. that was a a, a Republican <laughs> word. Oh, sorry. shout out to the Republicans and, oh, and the Democrats. I ain't. Yeah, we we not we ain't gonna, we ain't gonna step into that. We ain't gonna step into that pool. We don't even want to do that yeah, one. We ain't yeah. gonna step into Muddy that pool. Muddy waters over there. Yeah. Stay <laughs> stay stay in that uh, sandy boundary. Yeah. <laughs> can I say uh, fuck Candace Owens? Oh, oh, sorry, oh, oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, you can. Yeah, yeah I, I don't think I don't you think can. nobody yeah. really likes her. But yeah, anyway, right. but oh, um, anyway. that is. Yeah, <laughs> what name you say? Candace Owens. Yeah. Oh gosh, yeah. I, I like. I actually like Candace. Yeah, shout Candace. out to Candace. Candace. I kick gun Shout out to Candace. She's Candace. very opinionated <laughs> and uh, she stands her ground. Yeah, I like strong black. I, I give I like that. strong black women. Yo. Kick her right in the imaginary balls. <laughs> I like strong. I like strong. I love strong black women. Yeah, I, like I mean, she, yeah, she is. Yeah, she I like I, I ain't gonna. She do hold on. She hold on. She, she yeah, Regardless yeah. of the argument, she right. holding on. Right. Whether you disagree or agree. She double yeah. down, triple down. Yeah, yeah but we ain't talking about you. We ain't, we ain't we, gonna go we to We ain't politics. talking about you right now, bitch. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so go ahead. Yeah, yeah. Talk yeah, about man. You. So, um, yeah. So, like I said, I took it to a, I took some of my music to some actual seasoned producers, and I ain't gonna lie, like. They was feeling it. They was like, yo, this is dope. And, you know, they like I said, they put they, they part on, like, helped me, you know, gave, gave me some um, feedback and stuff like that. But, man, from here, since, like, pretty much after they did what they did, I just been, like, more inspired to keep going. So, yeah. So, um, so yeah. let me, what happened when you, what happened when you got into this industry and you, and you said, like, damn, I, I, I could really do this? Shit. Um, what, what was that? What was that feeling like? Yo, let me tell you something. Um, because we're in a social media era, um, I just feel like it's so possible, so more possible than it was like you know, ten, fifteen years ago. Because like, I just feel like if I keep going and keep putting myself out there, I feel like one of these joints gonna be a smash mm-hmm. and somebody gonna snatch it up, yo. So. I just I just feel like it's you know it's easy to do than it was twenty years ago like yeah. so I, I just feel really confident that it's gonna happen um, you know with the help of you guys of course my my fans and my mm-hmm. you know my my partners my brothers you know with helping you know promote promoting it and everything thank you for having me up here by the way mm-hmm. yeah. yeah is there oh, is there like a covering. is there like a fear of um, let's say trademark or someone stealing some beats you know you go to the you know, you go to the studio, you play something for someone, they can chop it up and make it better, like you just said. But yeah. where's the business slash friendship? How do you kind of juggle those? So, I'm pretty sure he's still walking that fine line. <laughs> yes, yes. So to be yeah. to be transparent with you, I'm I'm still learning the business, yeah. which makes me probably a little naive. Yeah. And um, I probably take it as as a compliment if somebody dubs down. But I'll figure it out in the long term if I don't get you know screwed too hard. If there's lawyers out there, some other way of getting, you know, getting what's mine in return, you know. But I, like I said, I, I take it as a compliment if somebody going to take my shit and make it better. Yeah. Be, so so let's ask the question. Has, has somebody stepped that, has somebody crossed that boundary? Nah, not yet. Not okay. Good. But like good. I said, if, if, if they do, you know, good luck. I catch you on the long run, you know. I, I we'll go catch get you lawyered on the side up, street. and I'll thank you, you know. <laughs> we'll catch you on the side street. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just you know, you gonna pay me yeah. one way or another. Hell yeah. We are from Newark. Hell you yeah. Get it fucked up around here. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! Supposed to hide that side. <laughs> <laughs> we are that's family. That's the, come that's out the, sometimes. That's the corporate Vinny. You ain't supposed to show the hood, Vinny. What are you talking about, man? We are family men. Yes, keep oh, that yes, to the are. side, right? Yes, we, we will be your ass. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, oh, hey. <laughs> yeah, we don't like thieves. Yeah. All right, so tell me about a time where you were sitting in there, you you were in there mixing, uh, you were in there producing the beat, and you were like, oh shit, I got one. Yo, let me tell you, that shit happened two nights ago, bro. Like I said, I'm I'm still working on it, but um, 
like the beauty the beauty in this for me is because I'm new to it. Um, right. I, I I know sometimes um, with anything people get like um, what is it? Um, shit. Like when you um, what is it called? Writer's block or something like that. So same thing with music. Right. You know, um, people kind of get stuck. Right. And um, because I'm this so fresh to me, like everything is I'm open to everything. I can hear ding 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 and I'm like, oh that's a hit. And you know, I could I could put that shit together. It's like you're about to turn to puffy and start Yeah, singing. yeah, hell yeah. Well, shit, I'm about to take that, take that. Shout out to Puff. I'm about I'm about to take everybody. Yo, let me tell you, let me tell you how fresh I am. Shout out to everybody. Yo, let me tell you how fresh I am. I don't even know how to sample yet, but I'm just letting y'all know once I figure that out. So start slowing those beats down. Taking all y'all shit. <laughs> taking so, everybody. So here's what we do. Um he is so like we say he is a producer. So what we do? We'll play another beat of his, so you can get a, another you know uh, sample of, of what he's been producing. Uh, you know he ain't been in there. You know producers. You know sitting in there drinking. Uh, you know some red Kool Aid. You know <laughs> bullshitting with himself. He he in there fucking really. You know in there trying to produce some hits. Put, putting the work in. You know putting what? Putting the work in. Putting if, the work in. Educating if, um, himself. If you don't mind, Tim, I'm actually gonna throw on. Um, I also wanted to throw, throw out there that I couldn't find a rapper. Now, okay. I think it's actually funny that all this all this talent out here, but you guys, uh, y'all need to get out of y'all shell. Y'all need to stop being like little, you know, uh, sensitive about y'all shit <laughs> and just come out and rap. Yeah, like, try like, try it. Like, so, so what he's talking about is he's produced a beat that I, I, I'm going to use on this show. Yes. So you will yes. hear it eventually. Yep. But since since some of these motherfuckers don't really want to, you know, uh, he ain't he ain't got the, you know, he ain't got enough hits. So I ain't got enough clout. I ain't, I ain't yeah, got yeah, enough flowers. Yeah. He ain't got enough clout. I don't want to jump on the beat. The man said, "Fuck it, I'm gonna jump on this beat and I'm gonna rap myself to put prom- promote and put this uh, beat out here so you guys can hear it." And that's yeah. right. and, and and that's what you're gonna hear right now. Him uh uh, uh spitting some lines on this over this beat. Yeah. And if y'all think y'all could do it better, come holla at me. I agree. That's how I'm feeling. So go ahead. Let that rip. Diamonds bouncing off my neck, I know these hoes watching. Pistol on my waist, I know my foes out here plotting. They making stories up, I guess they out here so popping. They wanna know why your boy shit is so popping. You should be getting to the bag, but you out here mad. I'm on cue, big stepper like a college grad. You gotta laugh when you see the pad. Birdman out here stunting like I'm Tunchi Dad. I hop in the range, you feeling away. I leave you estranged. I mean, when I say I've been up in here just like a toupee, been beating it up just like a souffle. I'm one of the greats, just call me MJ. I came in to win, I'm not here to play. Don't worry about when I got hit, just know I'm here to stack. Sad part is that shit yeah. sound dope. Yeah, yeah. Yo, thank I like you, the beat ride a little bit. Let the beat ride a little bit. Sound yeah. dope. Let the beat ride. I want to hear that beat at the end. Appreciate it. Let everybody hear the whole thing, man. Don't yeah, cut yourself beat. off yeah. like that. Oh, my bad. Nah, that's, that's, that's pretty much it. We that wait. Well, don't don't cut yourself off like that, man. That's pretty nice, though. That's pretty nice. I like it. I like also how you you started off with one flow and then you kind of sped it up on the second part. Yeah, man. Listen, man, I was inspired by MC Sako. <laughs> Yo, listen, like this beat is hard. Right. Yo. One. Sako, come back out. Uh oh, uh oh. Yeah. <laughs> Go ahead, spit that 16. Easy, one easy, 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 easy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to catch I a case like up here, man. Well, that's a good beat, though. Nah, that's, that's a nice, beat, man. Yeah, yeah, we, that we, one. So, so, so look forward in the future. Y'all hearing that beat uh, on a consistent basis. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes. Uh, uh, rock but that one uh, we, uh, the man is looking for uh, everybody. Want to uh, um, uh, everybody in the hood want to be goddamn rappers, mm-hmm. but nobody want to you know look for a producer to produce his raps. Yeah. So that don't make sense to me. So come and look for the man. He on Facebook. Uh, you on Instagram. Instagram, Instagram. Let, let, let everybody know where you at, wherever they can find I'm you. On, I'm on Instagram, I'm on TikTok, I'm on YouTube, all in the same name, SB Prodigy. Any spaces, any commas? Anything? Um, it's just SB, and then it's Prodigy. There you, you go. My, you my no space? spaces, no spaces, right? No. Um, so it's I SB, it's, 
SB together space prodigy. Okay. prodigy. There you go. Yeah, so. SB SB space prodigy on Instagram. Yeah, man, I'm there. YouTube. There you go. YouTube, Facebook. Find a man. Find if you're looking for a, if you're looking for a producer to produce your beats, produce put an album out. Come and find a man. I, I, you know, I know you can't afford these motherfucking you know big time uh, producers that y'all are trying to fucking find. Yep. Mm-hmm. No, you're not going to get them. Yeah. Word. Look at you're look not. at the look at the baby. <laughs> yeah. The baby didn't start with no big producer. Him and his boy in the basement. I started small. small. No, nobody nobody knows you. No, yeah. Nobody knows you as a rapper. So go and find a guy who else nobody knows mm-hmm. so you both of you guys can collab together mm-hmm. and produce nice. a fucking hit yeah. so both of you guys can blow up. That's, that's Stop true. trying to get in your feelings. You know, uh, other people thinking you're fucking trash because <laughs> yeah. you got some other bum-ass motherfucker producing your album. No. You got a guy right here who can produce your album for you. Yep. Mm-hmm. So get with him. He just told you where he was. SB Prodigy on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram. Yeah, follow him. Yep. Check him out so he can get so you can collab with him p- to produce your album. Yeah, stop it's, fucking around. And think about that's it. Right. This guy don't know how to rap. And if he could, if he could lays bars like that, just imagine a spirit, a experienced rapper yeah. jump on that beat and do that. Uh, just b- think about yes. it. By the way, the man just spit that fucking line right there. For his first time today. <laughs> it sounds great. I actually. never rap in my life, I promise you. These are my brothers, they all tell you I don't fucking rap, but Yeah. No. So Man man trying to put himself out there, so he gotta do what he gotta do to put himself out there. And you motherfuckers who thinking you can't rap, you bullshitting out there with these bullshit ass egos mm. don't wanna, you know. Thinking you're gonna get Kanye. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes you gotta get May yeah. <laughs> start off and then you, you get Kanye. Crawl, man, you gotta crawl. You gotta yeah, crawl I agree. Before. You gotta yeah, crawl before you yeah. walk. Crawl before you walk, man. Stop thinking you fucking Jay Z. Stop thinking you fucking you know Meek Mills well, or any of these fucking guys. Thank you, Jay Coles or some shit like that. No, you at the bottom. You mm-hmm. at the very bottom. You you eating grass and dirt and shit. Everybody That's what you eating start. right now. Everybody got to start from the bottom. Yeah, right. start from the bottom. You know, work your way up. Word. Cut it. Cut it out. Mm-hmm. You know, you could. It's all right to work from the bottom. Get, as, as, as every fucking rapper say, you got it out the mud. That's what you do. So yeah. get get it out the mud yeah. with my man right here. My man yep. trying to get it out the mud. Y'all work to let work together. Get it out. You know, collab. Get it out the mud together. Yep. The yep. fuck, man. Stop the bullshit. Help help the black man. Help another black man. Yep. Damn, that's true. Stop Fact. fucking around. SB Prodigy on YouTube, Instagram, and Facebook. Help like a man, it. help a brother out. Do it now. Help, help another brother out so he can help another brother out. There you go. There you go. Word up. All right. And I ain't breaking the bank, so. Yeah, he not man, man not breaking the bank. He not asking two hundred. He not asking a quarter million dollars for a beat. <laughs> the fuck, man. <laughs> Damn, man, trying to get on his feet just like you are. Yeah, it could be a, a start of a. Beautiful relationship. There you yes, go. Yes, relationships yes. are the best. Yes, yes. You want to be the man? Yeah. What, what's yeah. that? What's that rhyme? You you wasn't with me when I was shooting in the gym. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. That's right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Girl, something like that. Yeah. I'm in the gym with you. Let me let yeah. me get in there. Yeah. Uh, I'm not in the gym, but just don't forget me. Yeah. Word. <laughs> I, mean, I can't. I can't I'm rap. I can't. Man. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. I just want you to pay my mortgage off, and then yeah. don't <laughs> I don't want no money. I don't never want no cash. So once up. again, once again, uh, SB, let everybody know where you can find you. Yo, you can find me on TikTok, IG, YouTube, under SB Prodigy. There you, there you go. There you go. Nice. I'm gonna come, right. come lay some bars. Hell yeah, yo, yo, don't, don't, <laughs> don't, yo, don't be fooled. I don't, I don't remember my rap name you're back then, but I'm, I'm going to update it to yeah. Chuck Nasty. You say lace bars, I'll Chuck start thinking about a Twix. <laughs> Chuck Nasty, and MC I need, to, I need to stop eating Twix. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you said oh, bars, man. I went to candy. I said that a Kit Kat wouldn't be bad right now. <laughs> 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 oh shit! There you go. My man in the he got a, he got his own workout station. What are you talking about, man? He in there trying to get it in, man. Yeah, damn. It's not the workout. The, it's the, not the workout. The, it's the diet. The, <laughs> <laughs> ain't consistent enough. The man diet and workout ain't consistent enough. But he no, in there trying, man. But not he trying, diet. man. 
Hey, the man, fuck, you look man. Good to me, it, man. It's better than you, motherfuckers, over there talking shit. Yeah. Not doing nothing. Putting people down. Putting people down. Stabbing them in the back. Damn. Fucking uh, back talking, back yeah. sliding. <laughs> back sliding. Baby back, baby back <laughs> eating. Hey, hey. <laughs> baby back bitches. Hey, oh, man. oh, can we use it? Can we say this? Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Call him a call, call him a call him a baby back bitch. <laughs> <laughs> you just saying. Damn. Yeah, the moral of the story is support your brother. Yes. Yes. Su- yes, support a please, black man. man. Support Thank another black brother. man to yeah. support another black yeah. man. Yeah. There you go. And yeah. stop. That, that's what this podcast is about. Support a black man to, to support another black man. And stop chasing other people's clout, man. Like, yeah. listen, they, they, everybody looking for that person that got a hundred thousand followers. Yo, that I, I don't. I ain't gonna lie. I don't. Right. You're not. You're people. not gonna get that guy because yeah. he's already. He's he already, already established. Did. Exactly. Yeah. So go exactly. and find the motherfucker who's already up and coming, just like you are. Right. And I right. hate to say when you when you get the guy who not that big and y'all become big together, that's your real followers. If you go yeah. with somebody yeah. who have a million people already, that's not your followers. They follow another they follow person that you follow. Person. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. Yeah. All right. Word so up. cut the fake shit and get real with it. Damn. Word up. What what's really the truth? Damn. I love it. I love it. All right. All right. So now that we got uh, uh you know what I want to know? How was my first my first interview? I did. I banged out two of them in one episode. <laughs> there you go. Very I well. banged out two Very of them well. in one episode. Give, give How was my interview? Yeah. If, you, if you like the interview, subscribe, yeah. like, and comment on what I just did as yeah. my first two interviews in one episode. Bang them out on the fly. Bars. Boom. Bars. There you go. You're about to put Tim on the track. And look, and look, <laughs> <laughs> and look. You can find SB Prodigy in all those places. Uh, you can't find me nowhere except LinkedIn. So there you go. Yeah, yeah. yeah. LinkedIn, yeah. If you if you try, uh, oh, if, if you're trying to find a job, <laughs> yes, look, yes. look on LinkedIn. Look on LinkedIn and Indeed and shit like that. Yeah, exactly. If you're trying to make a beat <laughs> yes. for your uh, for your album, look on Facebook, Instagram, and uh, and uh, YouTube, else. YouTube, and everything all, else. All TikTok, TikTok, there you go. SB, SB Prodigy. SB Prodigy. SB Prodigy. Yeah, all right. SB Prodigy, SB Prodigy, SB. You got both. You got both avenues to go. Yeah, I know more. Of you motherfuckers want to go with the SB Prodigy, <laughs> shit. <laughs> but you motherfuckers need to go with this route. But I'm not. I'm not. I'm not neglecting what this man is doing. Yeah, huh? I'm just saying, if there's another avenue for you. There is. There's another avenue for there you. Is. If that shit don't work out, you there got is. a job hey. right here waiting there for you. you. Hey, but hey, 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 SB Prodigy is his hobby. And hope it become a career. Yeah. But and he have a career already, though. And he it's got good. a full, full time job. And right. it's good. And it's good. And, That's and, why but, you can't just hold on to your hobby and not work. You got to yeah, work right. somewhere else until you blow up. Again, it's, it's ambition, right? He has ambition. So no one is forcing him to do this, right? No one's, no one's begging him to do this. This right. is something that he sees a desire to do. Yep. And he's moving forward with it. He's right. educating himself. He's getting better and better to the point where he can actually leave his. Job, yeah, you go. Right? Leave is yeah, not that's because that's everybody's dream everybody to leave dream. their nine to five to do what they dream, yeah, yes, yes. true, yes, and that's what he's striving to do. You know, I'll be honest with you guys, I don't know if I have a real dream. I I'm mean, st- I'm still figuring it out. I mean, like, no, you know, and I always, I mean, think, if I if I made the money you made, I guess I wouldn't no. have a dream. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you know, I'm not talking from a money perspective, <laughs> I'm saying doing something that you love every day, regardless yeah. of the money, yeah, 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 you're right, right. regardless of the money, that's well, the dream. Miles would be electrician that you can do every day. Every day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you like I'm fine. You're fine. Ten thousand yeah, yeah. dollars a year, you fine. Ten thousand dollars. Ten thousand dollars a year? You, I'm, twenty. I'll give you twenty. Twenty thousand dollars a year? No, nah, I'm selling out for the job with more money. Okay, you want the job with more money. Okay. So that's what I mean. about money, but if 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 I had to pick make the same money to compromise to make if you, the same if you money, just choose, yeah. Yeah, I I'm going with uh Maybe more electrical work. Yeah, that's, uh, that's more I my dream. Felt, I always felt like I just wanted to get like own my own gym, almost like just I can just be in a gym every day, and literally I could be you know talking to people, coaching, mingling, yeah, also working out, also staying in shape myself. Yeah. That would like be like one. it's a it's a great job because it's like would, you I'm know what honestly I thought I would have thought Charles would have said that no no, no no that would be my. One of my freaking top because I, I, you know, I go to the gym so much. Right. I work yeah, just out. go to gym. Like that would be that would be ideal. Own a gym yeah. and like you are it. Like you got the. But people you, on the see, that's bad though. That might be, you might be right 
Because w- when you said that, I'm thinking about working. I think uh, if I had a job doing that, I won't feel like it's work. Right. Correct. Mm-hmm. Correct. Mm-hmm. That, that's how I so feel. So you might be right. That's might how be right. I feel. That's Maybe how it's I, not being an electrician or doing electrical yeah, yeah, work. It might right. be Go, in the owning gym. a gym yeah. and to the point where now I'm going to live and die dieting in the gym, and training right. this people. This is my gym. This is my job. Uh, and, uh, yeah, this is my job, but I love it. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. I love it. You right. might be right. Now, you might be right. I even think about it like that. So I might have to switch that to gym. Yeah. There you go. See? I agree. And I'm yeah, I know the man. Right, yeah. I'm, I'm with him. I, I think I can wake up every day and go to the gym mm-hmm. and be happy. Yeah, happy. Yeah. And I could be like, I, I, I think I'm, I would truly be happy in the gym. Yeah. Now you're right. There you go. Yeah. All right. Um. So let's get away from that. Um. I'm a. And let's transition to um. NBA because I'm a heavy NBA guy. Everybody knows me. I'm a heavy basketball guy. I'm always watching basketball all the time. Right now we watching basketball right now on the tablet <laughs> as we're filming this right now. Yeah, so right now. As, as, anybody want to know? Anybody that doesn't know, we watching basketball right now as yeah. we're filming this. Technology so all over the place. Fuck you if you if you you have a problem with that. <laughs> but <laughs> um, who who do you think? Uh, as it stands right now, the Celtics and the the Warriors are in the in the finals. I, I don't give a damn what the score. I don't give a damn what the score What's is right. I don't right give a damn. Now. Calling it. I don't damn. give a damn what the score is right now. Ain't giving Miami a chance. Yeah, I don't give a damn what the score is right now. It's Boston and the Warriors in the Boston and Golden State in the finals right now. How many games you got it going to in the finals? Five, seven, five, six. Five. I'm going with seven. Uh, four, two, Golden State. Mm. Four two Golden State. Hmm. I'm going four three Boston. Boston. Oh, I like hmm. that. I like you going I, Boston. I'm, Boston. I'm wow. I think that defense going to frustrate those boys. Yeah. I gotta the ah. spirits. The spirits might try to take over. But yeah, I think that's that, what I'm saying. Yeah. But that defense though. Listen, that they made the, Kev, they made Kevin Durant look really <laughs> mediocre. I'm not confident. They, they that made, motherfucker ain't he ain't they Curry made, and Clay and Poole and they do got more people though. Yeah, but the thing is though, it don't matter who's guarding who. Clay right. could go funny on whoever on on go on uh no get Tyler, I will, get Tyler Hero over here. I'm going to kill this guy. Who do you do that on Boston? With? Right, I will say Boston can switch with everything. Who you who you doing that? We gonna yeah. bring Horford up there? Horford gonna play him pretty damn yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, so who nah, you gonna put on Jalen well, Brown? Oh no, Tatum. <laughs> Yeah, nah, those like, guys. Who is he going? He's, who is one on one with? Like, who is he? He gonna have to come off the of screens. You know how that oh, screen no, goes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. screen. And they yeah. bumping the shit out you like they doing KD. <laughs> yeah. See, see, Steph Curry don't like being physical. You ever noticed? Nah, Steph Curry true. is not a physical guy. Nah, that's true. Let me see the first game first. Let me see the first yeah. game how it plays out, mm-hmm. and and then I can make a. I mean, I'm not I'm not putting no money down, so oh, I can yeah, do yeah. that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah, I yeah, can yeah. do that. Yeah, so. yeah. yeah. Let me see the first game. Let me see how the first game goes. Yeah. Let me see how the first game go. Then Do y'all bet on a, uh, games at all? Huh? Do y'all bet yeah. on games at all? I no, I don't. Not even yet. even with that the even with the the legal gambling, I still don't. Yeah. Oh, like I'm legal betting. Like, no, do you no. bet at all? Do you I even gamble? Do you? Because I know people be doing these parlays. Oh, and right. all. They yeah, got yeah, yeah. to under over and all this. Right, okay, yeah, dog. Yeah. I don't. I don't I even don't. understand the rules. I'm, I'm a cheap motherfucker. Uh, <laughs> I keep my money in that, my damn pocket. That too. Yeah. yeah. I'm not. I'm not. If I lose my bet, I take that personal. Yeah. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not <laughs> privy to. Yeah. I'm not privy to losing my fucking money. Every time I bet, I expect to win. I might ass bet. So you know what. They gonna bet at all, <laughs> right? Yeah, yeah. I, I don't bet either. I just figured out the uh, ask that question. You yeah, yeah. Now I'm cheap man. with certain stuff, and that's not. Yeah, I don't. I don't. No. I feel like it's throwing away your money. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. To me, and, yeah. And, and you're putting your you're putting your money in another person's. Uh, right, right. <laughs> in another I have like, no I'm control over that. this. Yeah, you let no control over. You, you just no put control. your money down and hoping God you fucking <laughs> win. No, Curry might go zero for seventeen. Right, yeah, right, yeah. Curry might have money on the bank on the game. Uh. I know me and uh, who is it? I mean, Vinny was talking about this off camera. Um, they were saying, you know, ESPN and uh, actually, I only heard it on ESPN. Who had the more impact on this generation? Would it be LeBron James? Nope. Or Steph Curry? Steph Curry by far. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's not even close. Okay. Yeah. I, agree. I hate to say it. You the style? It's just impact. Impact. All together. Really? Um, impact. Because yeah. LeBron is what? Who who is LeBron? Name a player who want to be LeBron. Sad part. Not not even LeBron, not even LeBron not, no, is a Le- not even not even who want to be LeBron. No, who think play? about how the game changed. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. 
Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like, LeB- you know what it is? LeBron do too much. So how can you be LeBron? Yeah. I'm a, I'm a walk in 28, 8, and 8. Yeah. Okay. It don't sound special, but okay. when LeBron, but you got but, Steph Curry shooting from the logo, yeah. and Think Steph Curry <laughs> shooting from here, and he juke you out your boots and shoot from here, because everybody think about the Reggie Millers. Yeah. yeah. Rick Hamilton's. Um, Allen. Ray, Ray Allen's. What yeah. you think of first? <laughs> running off the of screens. Running off the of screens. I heard, I heard this many a times. It's Ray Allen, Rip Hamilton, Reggie Miller, all had a fucking baby and ended up with Steph Curry. Yeah. yeah. Nah, you're right. Look at JJ J. Reddick who just was saying it. Yo, we got one move. He said, Ray Allen, me, Reggie Miller. Catch the ball, go over the left shoulder, and shoot. It's one step to the left yeah. and shoot. He said, Steph Curry, boop, 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 hit you a five piece. And it, and it step back from half court Steph, and Reggie, splash it. Reggie Miller was... <laughs> Run off a screen, catch and shoot. Yes. Yeah. Ray Allen early in his oh, career Ray Allen was could awesome. get off the dribble he and shoot, shoot, but later in his career he turned to a strictly catch and shoot. Yeah. yeah. Rip Hamilton was run around screens, catch yeah. and shoot. Yep. Fucking Steph Curry can fucking Cal Cova hit you with the Kyrie Irving <laughs> yes. and still Steph, get off yeah. a fucking thirty five foot jump shot yeah. and hit you in the mouth with it. So mm-hmm. I think I think that the reason why people did a lot of players don't want it or even people want to be like LeBron because it's hard to be like LeBron. Yeah, he 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 has a he came in the game what six eight he was like two fifty. That's there you go. Right. You know, and, wait, wait, wait. and he was the fastest person up and down the court. Right. So how many people the strongest and the fastest? He's a unicorn. Right. Yeah. So it's hard to to <laughs> to, 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 rep, I, rep, to replicate. I heard that. this. I heard He's this a from, unicorn. Yeah. I heard this from ESPN too. How many motherfuckers are six eight and can run that, up and down the floor right, like a gazelle, right, like right. LeBron James? Yeah, it's a unicorn. How many yeah. people are near six feet ish and, and can shoot? Can do a step back and 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 believe they can shoot like yeah. Steph Curry? Yeah. Not yeah. everybody. Everybody. Yeah. Everybody, yeah. Can't, yeah. everybody can't. Yeah. Everybody can't shoot like Steph. No, but how many people no, can't believe, believe no, no, they no. can shoot like him? You can shoot like Steph. No, 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 fuck that, can't. No, 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 no. You can't shoot like the Steph. Form. That don't mean you it's gonna go in. Yeah. <laughs> are you mean? Are you mean attempts? Yeah, yeah, yeah you, attempts, you, you yeah. can get the ball. Yeah, up, yeah, ball up, you, up, yeah, you step yeah. back. Yeah. Don't mean it's gonna go in yeah, though. Be, sit your right it's a right lot more that motherfuckers bench. that's between six feet and six three, who can you know jack up a fucking thirty foot fucking shot. Than it is a 6'8", 250 pound fucking guy <laughs> who can barrel down the fucking lane at fucking full speed. Yeah. And, you know, average 28 a game. Yeah. So that's why many people more, many more people can believe they can be Steph Curry than they can right. LeBron James. That's why Steph Curry, also with the fact that he changed the game with shooting from half court. Not everybody doing Yeah. 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 Logo Lillard won't we'll, we'll have that. Hmm. Logo Lillard. Oh, Lillard, yeah. Even that. James Harden. James I mean, Harden. I mean, you know, people. No, I don't, I don't think Harden. Harden ain't really, Harden 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 really shoot ones. from. James Harden was the king only two of, guys. Only two guys I know that shot from that distance was Lillard, Lillard no, no, and uh, Curry. Okay, yeah. nah, then again, on a consistent basis. Yeah, on a consistent who, basis. Who, yeah. who did? Who y'all think the step back came from? Was it Steph or was it Harden? I thought it was Harden. It was hard. More, more Harden. I thought it was. Yeah, uh, might be more hard. It back. might be more Harden because I was, think he. Cause Steph did it, but he don't do it like as much. Hard. What the the? Yeah. What, what are we talking about? Houston Harden or uh, Houston Harden? Yeah, <laughs> Houston Harden is Houston. trash. <laughs> like I don't think that. I mean, who who started? Because Steph <laughs> do that weird ass. Travel step back too. Yeah, it's yeah. like a that's like a. I don't know what the fuck that back, is. Though, yeah. It's like a stumble. Yeah. What's they do a pure step back? Yeah. Like, well, you guys do two or maybe three step backs. Yeah, I was about to say. It sometimes it's, I it's see a him taking, of, Sometimes I see him walking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Travel, yeah, yeah. travel. Yeah. It's a couple yeah. of steps. Yeah. <laughs> you get away with it. Yeah. You get away with it. Now you now you can't even you can't even jump in front of these guys. He's scared to kind of jump in front of them because they got to land. Right. Yeah. yeah. Well, so that's because fucking that's um. That's Zaza Pachulia fault for fucking spraining Sprain his Leonard. ankle with uh, um, Kawhi Leonard ankle. Cause so it's like now, and it's like you don't even want to like. How yeah. do I? You got to find a different way a, to. Yeah, they be jumping to the side now. Yeah, yeah you got to. So you their arms, to. Their arms are not even going straight up. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, they're jumping. They're not even jumping towards the person. They're jumping to the right or the left of them. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's like eh, this game is trash. <laughs> Game is trash. They protecting their uh, investment. Look at it that way. I mean, yeah, 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 yeah. that's true. Protect. It's a lot of just money. Like, just I like to say, I, I would love to see that series with Kawhi Leonard, than not without him. Because once he went out, that series went left. Yeah. Mm. When Kawhi yeah, went out, it was yeah, over. it was it, over. Uh, if you remember, they was up by over twenty fucking yeah, points before he went out. out. 
That's crazy. They was going to beat them up. Zaza bro. fucking stuck yeah. his shoe on. The dad looked at intentionally, though. Pur- purposely. He, yeah, that yeah, wasn't, that that wasn't was terrible, by man. mistake. Listen, I would've, by, yo, I would've by any beat. means necessary, no? I want to <laughs> win. <laughs> this ass, yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to win. By the old school rules, yeah. Yeah, yeah I want to win. New NBA, no. I want to win. I, I see him today. I think they be running to the hole. They be, yo, they be doing offensive fouls all, all the time. Yeah. They run to the hole and have their left arm out right now. Oh, they some flopping mofos yes. too. S O F T soft, <laughs> soft, <laughs> soft. <laughs> yeah, nah. This this yeah. this new game is. Uh, yeah. I don't know if they'll be able to survive back in the day. No, oh, no, they no wouldn't way. be able to survive. That's why you always Not get the. No, I don't. I don't know if you guys ever had this uh, conversation up here, but that's why you always get the comparison between you know who's better, uh, LeBron James or uh, Michael Jordan. And they always start saying, oh, he's getting his ass whooped by the Pistons and getting his ass whooped by this team, that team. And like, I'm yeah, but. still going with Mike. <laughs> this debate is. Now, I mean, if I had oh, to pick and choose, I, had to, I had, to, had to pick and choose who. Who you want on your team? <laughs> <laughs> I, would, want, I would rather play with LeBron. Who do you want? Yeah, I mean, team? yeah, but because I, he's, I, a, he's I, a better but, passer, yeah, I, but, I guess. I'm going to. <laughs> that punching people in the face, this dude shooting thirty shots, want to take the last shot all the time. I, I wouldn't want to play with LeBron, but if I had to pick him for my team, I'm going with Jordan. Yeah, <laughs> going with Jordan. Now, who I, if I had to go on the court? Yeah, I want yeah. If you want LeBron? If, if I had to, if I had to if pick, you got to. If, if I had I'm to playing, pick, I want LeBron. Yeah, if I had to, no, if I had to pick, a got to win. I'm taking Jordan. Oh, I mean, this I guess. I mean, Depends I guess his last. Depend on what kind of team Jordan got. If I, not, I, he gonna take I guess that his ball last with. four or five years, maybe six, uh, LeBron got that, you know, dog mentality. But for the majority of his career, that motherfucker, here you go, take it. I don't want it. No. It was? Drive. Three and kick people, it. Three people collapse on him. Jordan is taking that shot and missing a lot of times. I would rather kick it out to that guy in the corner. I mean, Jordan did do that. I mean, Jordan did do that. At the end of his career. No, no, we talking about during his career. He was nine years in before he started passing the ball. That was the coach. Okay. LeBron came in with that idea, with that mentality from the the, rip. Who was the first person? It wasn't Kirk. Paxson. Paxson. He passed it to them. Yeah. He won a championship. It took oh, no, nine it was years for him to figure it out. He did it for Paxson and he did it with it uh, Kirk. Kirk. He didn't get his, first, Kirk, he didn't get his yeah, first ring until Shit, nine, I thought, after I nine years. I mean, DJ Armstrong. It took a long time. <laughs> yeah. he, he took half his career to learn how to pass the ball. And I'm just saying, I wouldn't want to be with somebody like that. I'm just saying, me I mean, the, But if I'm, I, I mean, if you watch if you watch If you watch the ESPN series... The fucking coach said, here, take the ball, do what the fuck you want to do. You could tell LeBron the same thing. Hey, get the ball, do what the fuck you want to do. LeBron's making that pass. Because if it's three people on me. He's making a basketball decision. He's making there a you go. Why would I? Why Kobe, everybody get Kobe and LeBron and Jordan all this damn respect. Watch I'm, him out. Watch I, him I, out. I, no, I'm just saying, I respect them. But at the same time, they made horrible decisions until later on. What well, Kobe did a little early because he had Shaq. But it took Jordan to learn how to play with his teammates. LeBron it from took, rip. It took from rip. It took it took Pippen and Phil Jackson to show him, hey man, you it's got okay. other teammates. So why would do we knock LeBron for know how to make basketball decisions straight from? Because the a lot of times he could have took it up himself. No, he couldn't. I think people. It was see double team. I, I think people want to see him take it up himself. That, if you look at that's, that's, that time, that time, I remember the time when he was playing with Cleveland. He passed the shit to Donya Marshall in the corner. That motherfucker could have took the basket. It was two people in front of him. It was dying. Yeah, I think that motherfucker could have barreled his ass over and took a <laughs> shot. Man. Okay, and then he would have took a horrible shot like Jordan would have did. That would have been a hard. What are you talking about? He would people, people. I think people would accept it. Yes, but what's not it's about accepting? It's James. about making the great play. It's not about accepting. You gonna give it yo, to fucking Booby nah. Gibson or are you gonna take the shot? Yo, that team <laughs> well, was trash. You gonna yo. give it to Booby yeah, Gibson or are you gonna take the difficult shot? So I'm taking the difficult shot. Who you, you gonna miss? To. Just like Jordan and, and Kobe. Th- that motherfucker, he missed. Oh well, so that's a, that dude is wide open. He's but, making but you're, threes. You're, 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 you're the start a team. How am I? Uh, I yeah. don't give a fuck. <laughs> it's all about who has. Yo, I'm, I I'm want gonna, you to be the star of the team. You think Steph Curry won championships like that? So, Steph Curry, yeah. Curry passed the, yo, you gotta, you can't say, I'm the, Jordan is a, everybody can let Joe, Joe was a dog, but let's just keep it real, his two teams was fit for him, pure defense, by the way, no one wanted to talk about that, they, I know everybody said, Kobe was a top five def, uh, defender, right? Yeah. When yeah, he had Shaq. He made a defensive team. When he had Shaq. <laughs> What the hell Shaq got to do when, with my defense? Because. He had a lot of steals, no, he had a lot of blocks, what are you talking no, about? No, no, no. You could play hard defense when. You know, you got the big fella behind you. 
when Shaq left and you had to carry that load to start scoring more, when did he start oh, stop making defensive right. loads again? I give you that. But did he make all defensive team once Shaq left? Yes. He might, he might have did once. Yes. A little bit, right. maybe. Yes. Yes, well, well, uh, but, that, but now, 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 now you can say, "Oh, but now, because he, he had the softest motherfucker behind oh, he him. The he had the softest yeah. motherfucker behind him, which is Paul Gasol. So, Paul so, if, he, Gasol. if he made the all defensive team with Paul Gasol around, that means he had defense. Yeah, Andrew Bynum was there. That defense team was pretty good. Then you had a. Yeah, you, you had a couple people. Yeah, he wasn't just was just Kobe on that team. Yeah, you had a couple people. A lot of defenders, a lot of smart and smart made the defensive player of the year. Right, he on the best defensive team. Every time he, that's why everybody keeps saying Jordan, Jordan was great, but he did Dan Marley. Who did he D that was anywhere near Jordan's skill? Uh, hey, man. Hey, hey, Name hey, somebody, hey, please. One, one person? Who? One person. Who? Magic. He ain't no damn magic. They put Jordan on. He to- he toes him. They put Pippen on him. He toes Jordan, and they put Pippen on him. He, yo, I want to say Clyde. I want to say Clyde the Glide, but he wasn't. He wasn't gliding by then. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they was. Motherfucker, that's the fuck he was. He was playing with uh, uh, with Portland. With Portland, yes, he was. Be- that's the was. Not the height of his athletic career. Name a move. <laughs> Show me a holler. I just see this motherfucker gliding in. Hey, 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 man. Hey, man. That's why they call him Clyde the Glide. Yo, you right now, you can put fuck. Jason Tatum on fucking Jordan. This motherfucker doing all kind of moves. No, who the fuck was Jason Tatum that he was doing in that era? Yo, listen. Jordan would have locked his ass up. I don't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> Just say, how you know? He got he look, he got a mediocre, he got a young Allen Iverson on him, made him look like a pure bum. That was Allen Iverson. I don't, I don't like that think. shit. I Everybody Allen Iverson, Iverson out. Who can't do Iverson hey, crossover? Hold up, hold up. Not not to nah, Iverson was pretty good. <laughs> no, I, no, I'm just, no, I'm just no, saying. I can say who can't Tatum wouldn't have did it. Because right Tatum, Tatum is a sometime ass motherfucker. That's but why. But that sometime he bust Jordan ass. Yeah. When he do do the sometime. Now he might take a couple he games off. He bust his ass now. I don't know about busting his ass. Ah, I don't know about that shit. What rules we playing? We playing old school rules. We playing these rules. We talking about old school rules. Old school rules. Oh, okay. Then you gotta then gotta come to new school. Then when you come new school, you gonna bust his ass. No one could do the old school rules, these new guys, because they don't know that shit. Ask Kevin Durant. <laughs> Yo, hey, uh, Ask Kevin Durant. They got a little physical with him. He got turned to... He, he didn't need to go back to the old school rules. <laughs> they was playing new school rules when he was fucking getting shut down. When he was with OKC. When he was making the playoffs against playing good Gold States, against Captain Jack and uh, all those, uh, Baron Davis and all those guys, yeah, he yeah. was getting shut down. When he was yeah, playing he was, against Chris Paul, against the Clippers, he was getting shut down. That's true, that's true. Right before he left. That's yeah. Yeah, you're right. Yo, I got a question. That's why Kevin Durant never be LeBron James. <laughs> what the? <laughs> Yo, do y'all? So, um, I like this guy. Let me just throw that out there, Luca. Oh, yeah, like I like Luca. Mm. Do y'all think Luca would have been able to do this against the um, the Jordan and Pippen era? No, 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 no. no. Okay. I think Luca would be on the bench crying. They beat him up. I think he'd be on the bench crying. He cried yeah. too much now. I think, I think he'd be on the bench saying, "Take me out." I think Yo, he'd be telling the coach to take him out. I no. watched this man. He'd have been Tony Kukoc. Cook. I watched this man cook two of my two of my favorite current defenders. No, um, Kawhi Paul, Leonard and Paul George and Paul George destroyed them. <laughs> he took them. turns whooping they ass. They put Marquise Morris on them because and they all, were so. <laughs> all I can say is, would he have done that to Jordan and Pippen? No, it, it, I don't think no, so. Of course well, not. you know He'd what? Been, no, but we had we had to say this though. Now, you not if, if, if he grew up in that era, he's going to be more physical. Okay. If Larry Bird, sorry, non-athletic I ass, about that destroy too. people, I, agree. I think Luca would do it. I, now, if he I grew, swear, if he, see, I because you, we always thing. keep saying. You can't go off of this times. If he grew up back then, that he's a little bit more physical. Yeah. Because Bird wasn't physical. Well, he Bird was physical. athletic. He was he a little. Was he was athletic. He was, athletic. Yeah, he was yeah, physical. I can't say he physical. physical. Yeah, yeah, no. I wouldn't say physical. He's physical with his he, mouth. He, 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 let, he, let you push him, really, he ain't let you push him around. He ain't let you push him around. That's different. I'm talking about. Yeah. I'm talking about like skill, like yeah, destroying yeah. people. Yeah. I already yeah. talked about No, he did. No, he destroyed people. Nobody, nobody saw, it. saw it. Though he was not elusive. He, yeah, yeah. He didn't. I don't. He Nothing. never went how, around. How, yeah. Wait, how, wait, wait. How how athletic do you think Dominique Wilkins was? He jumped over. He was. He was giving him thirty five buckets a night. Yeah. 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 Dominique yeah. Wilkins was the most athletic motherfucker in the NBA in the eighties. He, was, he was giving a motherfucking plus thirty a night. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Luca's too soft. No, yeah, no, I'm no. I, I think Luca's pretty physical. I no, but I don't. I don't yo, know how he would. I, I just don't see you know him why, doing you it know against why? Pippen. You know why? The only reason I say he might. Yo, he's doing it to the best defenders in this day yo, and age. Kawhi and Leonard, it, it, it looked too easy. Paul George. 
I think yo, even he, he's Wiggins. Like, he's like a, yeah. a slow strong. I, it, I don't get it. No, no, no. He, he's a he's a different type of uh, office play. You got the it's guys who fucking uh, you know go hundred miles an hour like yeah. fucking Westbrook. You got the guys who fucking you know like Kyrie. You know you know got all the fucking moves in the in the handbook. You know bust your ass that way. And you got the guys who can fucking go at their own at their pace. Own pace. Yeah. Yes, yes. And that's Luca. And yeah. scary. you're not going to slow him up. I nope. can't figure I mean, that you're not, shit out, You're not going to speed him up. You're not going to slow him up. He's going to got his own pace. Yeah. And, and he's he going to kick your you ass. <laughs> yeah. I don't get it. I don't get it's it. It's weird to me because I'm used and to you, you can't speed him up. Players. You can't, you know. Yeah. He's going to got his own pace. I want to make him a post-up uh, player. He should be. He should be. Yeah. Like he the step back three point is trash. He should be. He's That's a small what, forward, but he plays the point guard. He should be yeah. posting up a lot of guys. But well, it's new NBA. You know, it's the new, it's the new NBA. So he's going, he going to jack up a lot of threes. He's too big mm-hmm. as hell, man. Yeah. It's a big back guy. these dudes out every so, time I see him on the court. I have yeah. to. I have to give LeBron. I have to. So so when I see players like him, it reminds me of like what LeBron has brought to the game. Obviously, you know, we had a Magic Johnson, but Magic brought more finesse. Yeah, 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 like the like Le, like Luca is bringing, you know, like he controlling the game. Yeah, and, and that's, how LeBron, that's how LeBron came. That's crazy. LeBron was. Yeah. You don't think he in the post? He'd come down and do a little, uh, uh. Yeah, like, okay, weird. I got him, and he is somehow still scoop he under goes, you and yeah, make the thing. I, I can't understand it. Nah. Neither. Yeah, he looks. It's he, weird. It's, it doesn't look good. And that's but you look Not at Bird. If you look at Bird game, that's how it was. Even though he's a way better shooter than freaking Luca. Like it's yeah, not even yeah, close. Yeah, but I'm talking about like. The Bird style. was doing the same thing to people. Like how, <laughs> how? Like this, yo, it don't even look like he should be doing this. But they said Bird talked more junk than yeah. shit. Michael Jordan. That motherfucker yeah. talked I, I a wish, lot I of wish, shit. I wish we would have fucking had cameras. Shit. Back he was then. talking. He was talking shit in the All Star game. Like yeah. which which one of y'all coming in second? <laughs> That's what he yeah. they, I, Word for word, that motherfucker <laughs> said, "Which one of y'all no, coming in second? I forgot who it was. I was looking at one of those podcasts. He said, <laughs> That's good stuff. "Bird said, yo, y'all gonna disrespect me like that." He had a white dude in him. Y'all really going to put him on me? <laughs> Bird was giving up like that, yo. Bird was uh, yeah. crazy on the low. Yeah, I heard uh, uh, Chris Paul is trash talking. Yeah, yeah, he's he trash yeah. talking. You can see that. Little talk trash all day, every day. A little short. Damn, CP3. <laughs> I don't six, think he get it. Even though he choked in these places. Yeah, he's not getting <laughs> no rain. I'm sorry. Seven, seven, you going to blame seven, him? Seven, You're not going to blame the other guy? <laughs> no, it's, it's oh, no, no. The whole, the whole team choked. Oh, but no, 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 I'm no. saying, though, the last several playoffs he's been in, he'd, uh, you know, shit the bed. So. This yeah. happened to him seven times in a row. He wet himself. What? Seven, seven. Seven, he had to lead. His last seven series. Oh, that's right. They did say, yeah. I did see that. Yeah, I did yeah. see that. Last seven playoffs, he had the lead, and, and he lost. He wet himself. So, was, whether it was through injury or he just wet the bed. He just, well, he went. Yeah. What he went? Fourteen for fifteen, and then he turned thirty-seven and got old. <laughs> what happened? He did have a birthday. No, no, no. He, he went perfect. He, he was perfect, perfect that game. He no, he missed like one. 14. He missed one. No, he, he was one. perfect. Now he jacked up that last shot. He missed one. I he thought he went one. perfect that yo, game. Yo, man, was, when, was, Booker, when Booker was like, he was 14 for 14, mm. and he jacked up one. And then he was like, I wouldn't have shot that. He was like, but Booker and them kept saying, he check, he check, he check, and I shot it. And oh. Booker was like, shit, I would have shot that. I thought he went perfect <laughs> that game. He, he lost, I thought the next one. game, he, you know, I fucked he up. A stank. Oh. Oh. The last three games, Sad. he played horrible. Yeah, he, he, he missed one. Be, at the end of the game, he jacked up some bullshit. Bro. <laughs> and Booker was like, shit, I would have took it, because he said he didn't want to take it. He said, I don't heat check. Hmm. He said, that's not my game. Oh, okay. Yeah, well, he shit the bed. Fucking yeah, like, after turn thirty seven. Yeah, <laughs> it was weird. Wow, he he ain't winning no championship. Anyway, five. I think he averaged five turnovers the last three games. Yeah, yeah he might have had five in the first in total three yeah, games. Yeah. Yeah. Some total. Yeah, no, he ain't winning no championship. That's it, fam. So yeah. Charles, you That's got right. you said Boston in seven. I'm going Boston in seven. I said Golden State in six. What you got, Tim? I'm gonna go with Sean. I'm gonna say uh, the Warriors, and, Warriors six. and six. Warriors yeah. and six. Vince, what you got? I'm saying Warriors in. Yeah, I guess I gotta go. I gotta go six. You going yeah. six? I gotta go six. Ooh. Yeah, I'm sitting on my own. Don't get me now. wrong. I would. I would like. I would like to see. I want to see set. I would like to see Boston. Well, at this point, just because uh, of the Boston team about to is. gonna go another game. 70 yeah. to 58. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> we better got to stop talking this ball. Either way, well, I want well, 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 me and Sean looking good then. Let's, <laughs> let's go, Jimmy Butler. Me and Sean looking good then. That's Might go boy. six then. Wow. Yeah. I'm a okay. fan of Jimmy, man. Should have still been in Chicago. Uh, what, somebody said Wasn't he coming off the bench uh, was that He started six man I he well, No starting. he was Then once Rose yeah. left He took over yeah. oh, Okay yeah And then he started uh, Hating yeah. the coach He yeah, got the Chicago coach fired trash, And then Chicago yeah. don't 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 max players 
Who yeah. last Max? We did the last Max play we had was Derrick Rose. Yeah, and we ended up trading him two years into his damn contract. <laughs> yeah, Rose, we yeah. about to we about to Max uh, Zach Levine and trade him. Maybe, maybe. Oh and yeah, sign and trade. Sign and trade. Yeah, yeah. they looking to do the same with uh, Kyrie. Yeah, yeah. I don't say, no, you know what? Fuck a, this. We Kyrie they putting their foot in the sand. You say, motherfucker, ah. you play this one yeah, year, that's yeah, it. Get Kyrie, you done. Fuck Kyrie. Yeah, that motherfucker's ass. <laughs> fuck him, man. That motherfucker's a, trash. He's a human highlight reel. Yeah. If you look at his highlight tape, he's amazing. But impact uh, on it, teams. Yeah, winning wise. Trash, trash, trash. The sad part is, I'll take Jimmy Garoppolo over, but fuck yeah. Kyrie. Yeah. 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 Garoppolo so bad. Yeah. <laughs> you want to compare him to football? I'll take Jimmy over fucking Kyrie. That motherfucker ain't do shit in the NBA. Take away that LeBron James yeah. finals. Yeah. What's his that what's his resume after that? Boston, trash, Cleveland. Oh my God. Trash. <laughs> uh Brooklyn. Uh Brooklyn. Trash. <laughs> no fuck ain't do shit in the NBA. Uh, he didn't play in Brooklyn, did he? Yeah. He, yeah, he, 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 he got full time at the end. Yeah, he had a part time. I mean no. part time for the half of the right. season, but once they implemented that's, the uh the the um uh, you know the COVID free, uh, shit, COVID? Yeah, he came back for the other half. So yeah, that's why he left though. That's why Harton left. Yeah. This guy wouldn't commit. Yeah. So and he was burned he was burning sage by his locker. <laughs> fuck that fucking guy. Who burned sage in a goddamn no, no, no. locker? Fuck room? that bum. He's Damn. Man, that motherfucker his ass. Damn. Fuck him. All right. All right. Um last topic. Uh since we all came from, you know, Brick City, City of Newark, Newark, New Jersey. Shout out. Um shout yeah, out. shout out to Newark. Um real real shout out to Newark because uh I don't, well, you know what? I'll take that back. <laughs> because I don't know if they if they're uh rebuilding Newark or if they gentrifying Newark. Ooh. A little bit of both. Ooh. Well, Newark is pretty big. North is pretty um, big. So a, a lot are of they a lot. They, are they gentrifying uh, Chadwick Avenue? No. Not yet. Uh, if, 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 uh, you know that you know that five oh five building that's on yes. Chadwick and Clinton Avenue. That shit yeah. look fancy. Did you see they it? they rebuild it? Yes. Oh, it is back. something right yeah. there. Yes, it is. What is yeah, that? Yeah, yeah. What are they doing Yo, there? Shout out it's to five oh five. It's it's not it's, the same. It's not, it's, the, it's, it's, it's not the abandoned shit that you know yeah, of. Yeah, that's right. That's <laughs> right. It's, it's apartment builders in that yeah, motherfucker. That's right. On the first floor, it's supposed to be a music gallery, if I'm not mistaken. That's crazy. So why not shout out the North? Yeah, I mean, because I don't know if they're. I know Braz Baraka keep talking about they're trying to stop from gentrification happ- happening. Yeah, but I don't know if he's going to be able to stop it. But it's pretty big, though. Yeah, right. But a lot of that uh, I saw where a lot of these LLCs, unknown, yeah, um, yeah. Uh, other companies, private um, developers. these private developers are. Buying up homes at a high, they're overpaying for these single family, multifamily homes. Oh, yeah, you can't just so they can put, you know, knock it down, whoever the fuck they, they either knock it down or put whoever they want in, which you know, whoever that is, you know, who we all know who whoever that is is. <laughs> uh, so you know, because you know, the people that previously lived there can't afford that shit. Yeah. If they if if the house was worth two fifty and these motherfuckers paid five hundred thousand for it, what do you think the rent is going to be in the multifamily home? What do you think the rent is going to be? Yeah, it ain't going to be fucking twelve hundred, eleven hundred, thirteen hundred. No, mm-hmm. it's going to be fucking twenty two, twenty five, twenty five. Yeah. So wh- yeah. why do you think the motherfucker going to be able to afford that? So they got to move. They got to move out of there, and so come the gentrification. Yes. Yeah, I, 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 I feel that it's happening in some parts. Yeah, because because they do the, got a Whole Foods downtown North. Yeah, yeah, which well, is which is crazy. That's downtown. What's the block, but what's the block you lived on, Sean? Um, the building you grew up in, MLK. Yeah. Oh no, no, no! They're knocking that uh, down. Yeah, well, that's, that's not going yeah. to. They knocking it down. Seth Are they Bo- really? They Seth, Seth Borden they gone. Knocked, yeah, Seth Borden. They plan on doing the whole. Uh, they plan on putting new homes up. Mm-hmm. Also, a new school there. No, mm-hmm. um, and a lion Lionsgate. Oh, that's right. They are doing yeah. the Lionsgate. They Lion, a, uh, Lionsgate uh, they movie, a, uh, movie studio. Movie yeah. studio. That's movie right. studio. Right. Yes. That's right. Yeah, they knocking. They knocking the buildings down and building low income housing. You it's it's gonna be. 30, it's gonna be low income housing. A brand new bad. school there that's gonna be put there. And no, and, uh, and no men are allowed. And, by the way. Uh, hmm? What? Hmm? <laughs> Look, no, no men is allowed. Just no men allowed. I, I didn't hear that. Oh, so, sorry. Just um, you I, gotta I, make I, under thirty thousand. You can't be a man. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, I got you saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, no men allowed. Yeah. 
So, uh, you, you're, <laughs> pissed, you're pissed off at the gentrification or the uh, the rebuild, but everybody knows. Wait, before be before happy. you before you get to it, everybody knows the low income housing. There's going to be strictly women in there. Yes, yes. no choice. Yes. There's going to be strictly women in it. There's going to there's no going to be no man and woman with children. There's going to be strictly woman with children. All men left behind. <laughs> no no go, man. The in man going to be there, yeah. but not legally. He can't be well, there legally. Yeah. Let's 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 keep it real. There's going to be no man. <laughs> yeah yeah yeah. Man. Legally no. Yeah. Are we are we no le- legally or illegally? There's going to be no man. <laughs> That's that's another story. Are we no? Are that's we, a, are uh, we dissatisfied? Let's, let's tell the truth. Let's let's tell the truth. What what's really the truth is there's going to be no man there. There's going to be a woman there with children in low in, in income housing in the neighborhood. Let's say neighborhood. I ain't gonna say the hood. Let's say in the neighborhood. Yep. So every, be everybody knows that the whether they want to admit it yeah. or not, there's going to be woman <laughs> with children. 2022, we promoting thirty thousand or under. They put the right. minimum wage well, up. That, to that's what they. That's what. He, that's what. That's what Mayor Roz Baraka and company said. They want to develop low income housing for people who make who make thirty thousand or below. Is it is it a stereotype to say that? And 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 no disrespect to nobody out there. Don't come for me. I'm just I'm just asking the question. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> hey, don't that low you. income housing will not be taken care of. What do you mean not take care of? Will it last? This I mean, year, oh, it, they, it, they will this year because uh, I, you got big ballers investing in this one. Queen Latifah, Shaq, it's a whole bunch. Right, of right. They all that they, they, that they all they stop all from fucking right. that apartment. Up. You're right. Oh yeah, yeah you're right too. Mm-hmm. They, they all invested. Mm-hmm. They they're all invested mm-hmm. in uh, different neighborhoods mm-hmm. over there by uh, South. 9th Street over like off of West Market and Central Ave and shit like that. They all invest South 16th Street. That's all right. those fucking developments are, are down by uh, where the North Bears baseball stadium is. Mm-hmm. All those developments over there. Uh, Seth Boyd and all these uh, places like that. But what the fuck is it stop them from fucking all that shit up? <laughs> <Exactly>. <laughs> just because just because they it's brand new. But I don't want to stereotype. Just because it's brand new don't mean that the 30,000 below people won't fuck it up. Hmm. Yeah, I, but yeah, but yeah. but we, they got to be working hard, regardless of the income. I'm working for my money. I'm working for. I mean, yeah. At, like, at, the, end the, day, at the end of the day, you at the end of the day, you are working for thirty thousand. It ain't no way in hell that so, so I'm I'm Section Eight is paying you thirty thousand. Yeah, so. so I'm appreciate. I'm gonna appreciate what I have. I'm gonna take care of it. That's, yes. that's what I'm trying I, to get. I believe. I believe. I would. I would, I would. think to believe to so. a degree. To, to a degree, degree. I would the, think. Well, go look at the newer houses that they put up in the last um, ten years or so. You walk through that neighborhoods. So, um, over there by the Prince Street, Prince Street, Prince Street. Over there by I the think way. Prince Street is actually pretty. It's nice still. Pretty still. No, it's still good. nice. I yeah. went over because Ga- gangster shit still happened over there. But oh yeah, but yeah. It, it, but it looks decent. It, it still looked decent. Yeah, because yeah, I went over there when I was doing the food and I was delivering to a couple people over there, and I'm like, wow. Yeah. Nah. And you know that stuff been there for just say eight, ten years, yeah, and it still years. looks nice. Nah, it now inside, I can't see the inside, but at least the outside look fucking great yeah, yeah, compared yeah. to what you we used to see. You see a bunch see. of bottles and cans on there the There you street. go. And the streets yeah. are clean. A bunch of dirt. They right, got right, right. No, nice, nice drawings on the walls. and They, they got they, speed bumps through the Speed bumps? Yeah. 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 Well, hey, um, can't even go speeding that, through. Well, that's everywhere now. Just, just yeah. don't, that's just don't go there at nighttime and, uh, you know, uh, stay too long. I mean, you still, yeah, you don't, still don't. got, you still got Martin Luther King Boulevard down the street. Yeah, just, well, uh, Nork is Nork. Don't, don't, don't right. sit in your right, car right, right. waiting for people to come right, out the right, car. Right. That's just a little <laughs> word of advice. Yeah. Don't, don't get fooled. And if you see a yeah, car yeah. come back around the corner, take off. Yeah, if you see a car take a lap, spin yeah. a block, and he turn his you, you turn best, his you off. best be wary of it. Just, just, just haul ass out there. Yeah. I've been to Prince Street one time when those buildings was up. My, my the, brother the lived over there one time. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Only man, been there I got one some time. Stories. I yeah. live. I used to stay over there. I used to be over there a lot. My brother stayed over there. That, I was over there one time, and I just went over there to pick my prom date up. <laughs> and I kept you had a prom date in the in the, in the, hey, the you know what? Since you brought that up, hold on. Since, you, hold on. Since, you, since you brought that up, I seen a lot of shit. I, oh, shit. Since you brought that up, I seen a lot of shit on Facebook. Uh-oh. Motherfuckers still spend buku amounts of money on prom, even though they're walking out of the. 
let's say Prince Street Projects. No, so no. They're walking no. out of Prince Street Projects. I'll give you a better one. Bradley Court. <laughs> Bra- Bradley they're walking Court. out of that. they're yes. they're walking out of Bradley Courts with a fucking Maserati fucking car <laughs> out in front <laughs> with a fucking two two thousand dollar dress on. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. I, I'm like, I, uh I I, I I don't get it. Yeah. Are, are, is anybody paying attention? Is anybody learning? Don't got a pot to piss in. Uh, uh, you live in the projects. Yeah. I don't get it. You spending all this fucking money for a high school prom. It look good for the yet, gram. Yet you can't <laughs> afford to fucking move out of there to pay for a, a no. regular. It's people's priorities. Let's just, let's just keep it real though. I, they, I, they, they might. Can, I know this. They yeah. might can't move out of there. It's, it's, no. it's what you know. It's people's priorities. Like, you know, don't, don't, I, you know, oh, you know, you know oh, how I feel about that. You know how I feel about that, but. Right. Let, let's get something straight here. I'm not speaking down on nobody. Yeah, yeah, when yeah. I was in high school, I did the same fucking thing. <laughs> not me. I ain't so no let's fucking not, let's not act problem. like I didn't do the same <laughs> yes, fucking thing. All I'm saying is nobody told me. Yeah. It's 2022. Somebody, they know it better. They know it better. No, they don't. Oh, they don't, don't actually, you know what? You're right. You're right. You're right. They don't know better. They don't know better. They don't know better. Obviously, yes, they don't know better <laughs> they because know better. they're fucking walking out of the TikTok. fucking project buildings, <laughs> trying to yeah, flash, <laughs> flash for the gram, off. flash for TikTok, oh, and they got roaches and rats in their house, and, and, and then and then pay rent yet. You're right. <laughs> they laid on their rent. Laid on their rent. They, they they ain't paid rent the last three four months. Oh, oh yeah yeah. They don't yeah. eviction notice. Yeah. And they fighting them. P S E N G bill fifteen hundred dollars. <laughs> it's free when you're in those kind of places. I oh, love my okay. Folks, I'm just saying. <laughs> All right. It's included. I love my. It's folks, included in the twelve dollar rent. Yep yep yep. You gotta do. Better. But but they got a motherfucking Maserati, Benz parked Jordan's, out front. All of it. You know, parked out front, parked out front, so they can go to the prom. Two thousand dollars. They paid twenty five hundred dollars for a dress. Fifteen hundred dollars for the for the man suit. What about the car? How yeah. much the car cost? They, they rented the car for how much what, the rent? Whatever, whatever it was, whatever it was to rent the car, they got the motherfucking. About somebody gotta have good credit about to do that. No. Yo, no. Toro. if I'm in Toro. the hood, Toro. you gonna Toro. let me borrow your car? Toro, yeah. you can money put your talks. car on Toro. Yeah. No, no, no. Oh, no, money talks. First of all, let's say let, let's give one thing clear: not many people in the hood have good credit. So and how you are they getting you these can talk, You can Toro. talk shit Oh you what are you talking about You can't say that Yes the fuck I can Nobody in the fucking hood Got good credit <laughs> Because they put their fucking PSCNG bill Cable bill All that shit In the kids name Yeah, That's true Alright So That's everybody true. knows that Everybody knows that secret That's true it, I mean it's not a secret anymore <laughs> <laughs> That's been uh, that's, that's been a, that's, that's been yeah, a non-secret yeah, For about 20 years Damn, now what, 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 what is that though How do we break that That still cycle? happen by talking about it, how do we break that cycle? I mean, that's, I mean, that's what this podcast is here yeah. to ask the, to get to these fucking questions get to the bottom line to get to the bottom line of these shit that nobody wants to answer. Yeah, well, yeah. there's a lot of there's a lot of uh, bad things that happen. In yeah, the well, no, but nobody I, I, nobody wants to accept it. Nobody wants to know. You right, man? I mean, yeah, we fucking know. They, no, they're gonna say, well, "What the fuck you talking about? Yeah, we ain't doing that shit." Yeah, they doing <laughs> it. They doing it and they loving it. And yeah, they, they loving their kids it. Kids yeah. lives up. Yeah. It's like your kids supposed to be doing better than yeah. you. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, fucking. How the fuck you three years old with bad credit? Yeah. <laughs> Somebody tell me that. How the fuck you three years old with bad credit? You ain't even fucking. Do, you don't even know how to walk yet. You talking about something you got bad credit? <laughs> That's not good. That's crazy. That shit still happening. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's, it's still, still it's still happening. happening. I thought that shit You don't even know how to walk yet. You ain't you ain't know how to, you know how to say like a full t- sentence yet. <laughs> you got, you got but you got bad credit. You got fucking 250 credit. And <laughs> and you're not and you're 3 years old, right? And you're not even your mother or father's child. You know why? Because they sold your social security number to somebody who has a job <laughs> so they can file, so they taxes, can file taxes to get money from you. Yeah. This shit is yeah. bad out here, yeah. man. Yeah. This shit is bad. It's hard out here, man. It's hard <laughs> out here. Well, <laughs> look, y'all, look, look, y'all poking the bear now. Somebody's going to be angry. No, this is bad. Yeah, wow. This is bad. Somebody's going to be angry. I'm, I'm, glad, I'm glad somebody's angry <laughs> so somebody else can see if they're angry, then that means they're, they're, there's a dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> This is what we do. If you're angry at what we're talking about right now, at right at this specific moment, you, I'm telling you right now, I'm looking in the camera, you're a dumbass. We're telling oh. all the secrets here. This is the truth. This is the podcast this is the, the truth. truth. What's you're, the truth? You're a yeah. dumbass and fuck okay? you. Yeah. The truth is you should not be doing this stuff to your children, number one, and you should be trying to make a better life for your children better than yours. Yeah. Just because your mother did it don't mean you got to do it's it. It's true. Stop. Yeah, we got to. Cut it out. Stop this. We got to change it, man. Cut it out. Change it. It's ridiculous. It's true. It's so true, man. 
It's sad. You could be in the hood, but be clean. You know. Tell my, I feel your passion, man. And I, I agree. I agree with what you say. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, I got to take it to that level because some people just don't fucking get it. Yeah, it's sad. Look at what Kevin saying with your ass, man. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's not. This, it's not what you're saying. It's I how mean, you're saying it. Right, I'm, I'm scared I, over here. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we should have got banned in the last episode, yeah. but we blanked the shit out. Yeah, yeah. So, if I gotta get if I gotta get banned this episode for what I'm saying right now, right. so be it. It's the truth. So be it nah, because it's, it's, the, it's, it's the it's the absolute. It's the it's the it's the truth. It is the truth. And and what is the truth? What I'm saying right yeah, now. Yeah, and and they gonna let you do that. They gonna so you. Uh, I know, I heard Charles said they still doing that. So the system's gonna allow you to do that because they're gonna win off of that. Oh uh, well, if you want to go, if you want to take it there, the system is fucking jumping up and down, clapping, yes. saying, yes. "Oh man, we got them right where we fucking want them." <laughs> like the we PPP got them loans. right where we want them. Like yeah. them PPP loans. Yeah. Hello. Oh. Woo. That Hello. P-P-P. Hello. They're coming. They're coming oh, to get you. Man. They're coming to get you. Well, they already got some. They already oh, got they a lot of motherfuckers. Oh, they well, they I ain't even talking about the PP loans. That shit. I'm just saying, it's still more <laughs> shit on top of shit. They let you. Yeah. They let you get that. No, yes. you don't have no damn business. Correct. Come on. Ass. Mm-hmm. Correct. Yeah. Well. Again. And, then, and we didn't go out there and 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 go buy a house. With that PPP no, loan? No, 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 no. What we, we did? What we, what we bought? We bought motherfucking uh, Jordans, uh, no, 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 not even Jordans. We bought snow crabs. Oh, That's what we bought. Damn. We bought snow crabs. <laughs> we bought a motherfucking yeah, we out of here. Five pound bag of snow crabs. <laughs> yo, <this> is- <laughs> hey, yo, the score of the, the Miami game is it's over. Oh, no, nah, it's eighty two seventy five. Uh, Did I turn the Oh, they're coming and, back. Yeah, they're coming All right, back. Uh, they coming. I still got, bo- I still oh, got no, Boston in seven. Back. He's back at it. I still got Boston in seven. I still got I Boston in seven. Damn. Right. Nah, it's only the fourth quarter. 11 minutes. They good. Oh, 11? Uh, uh, it's good. This game ain't over. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I want to give a shout chance. out to Gio. Um, it's an honor and privilege. Yo. Oh, yeah, you're right. Shout out, in this, in this shout out to Fortune, a.k.a. 45. My man holding it down in, in uh, um, uh, Myrtle Beach with his uh, car club. There you go. Um. Hold it down, hold it down for them. Uh, we'll, you will see him and Gio holding it down, for my man Gio. Uh, they will Dooney. be back, Mister Mister Dooney. Dooney, Gio, aka Fort, uh, aka uh, Mister Dooney. Uh, he will both of those, both of these guys will be back uh, next week. So uh, don't get worried. I yep. know you guys. I know all the ladies missing Mr. Dooney. Yeah, they are. Uh, but he will, ladies. He will be back. By the way. Uh, he is married, so don't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, it's just know. entertainment don't, purposes. Don't get the man in trouble. Only by on Tuesdays. <laughs> don't get the man in trouble. By <laughs> 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 don't get the man in trouble by DM DMing him. All yeah, right. yeah, don't send him pics of the Dooney. Man. Yeah, just, right. Don't send right, him man. pics of your ass. <laughs> Damn. Uh, you or know, do. bleached and waxed. Uh, you <laughs> know, I'd be scared to put bleach on my yeah, asshole. That'd be something, you know. All right, um, but again, once again, real quick, uh, we about to get out of here. But again, let everybody know uh, what you uh, real quick what you do, okay. and uh, you know you can. Uh, I will say where you can find them on uh, LinkedIn. Yeah, yeah, and, uh, yeah, LinkedIn. There you go. And indeed, you know no, if, I, you, I, if you <laughs> if you're looking for a job, <laughs> if you're looking for a career, career, career go and yes. look this man yeah, up look, look, right this now. Guy is making me out to be HR. <laughs> Okay, I'm not HR. I'm not hiring anybody. He's not HR, but I'm, I'm telling you, if you're looking for a different career path other than fucking rapping and you know, yeah, I can talk to you, dancing and shit like yeah, that. We, we can definitely and speak. playing ball and uh, being a nurse. There's another avenue for you, and that's being the IT. And what's IT stand for? Yeah, information technology. There you go. I'll just All right. something new again. <laughs> <laughs> and also, uh, uh, for all you guys, you know, downtown Broad and Market, everywhere else, <laughs> Urban Turn, uh, up there in uh, Urban Urbanton Center, uh, everywhere else we are selling your mixtape, selling shit like yeah, that. Are. Yeah, they do. You can find SB Prodigy where? On YouTube, IG, TikTok, all that. Yeah. Yeah, man. There you go. There you go. It was a pleasure. SB Prodigy. We gonna rock that beat at the end. 
All right, and we gonna play. We gonna play uh, another beat for you, so you let this know. Let you uh, know what this man is doing for a living, man. All right. So mm-hmm. it, it's, it's in case you guys don't have a fucking producer <laughs> to produce your lyrics, your sixteen bars, your twenty, whatever the fuck it is, uh, come and holler at this man. No, they don't yeah. do sixteen no more. Eight. Eight. Oh, you're right. Because <laughs> the fucking song is two minutes long. <laughs> yeah. you know, people's attention span is Trash. like a like a, 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 a goldfish. <laughs> so oh, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm gonna try to try to save the game. Game, guys, because I know it is. Right. It is a little. It is a lot of trash out there. Right, so right. There you go. So holla at this man on his uh on his social media if you want to if you're looking for a producer to produce your albums at a fucking not at not at a uh, Dr. Dre uh, <laughs> produce uh, money amount. This man will hook you up. All right. Yeah, no, Damn. All right. Go. All right. Let's get up out of here. What's the, what's the, what's the name of this beat? It's called Lost Souls. So if y'all want to find yourselves, holla at me. Like, nice. You would guys feel like you want to rap over this Lost Souls beat? Holla at the man, SB Prodigy, all right? There you go. And we'll be out of here. Peace, all right? Peace. Peace, peace. peace.